and here you go, Jeff. <laughs> I do. Uh, welcome to House Rule Pathfinder Society Monday Night Play that we've been doing for a while now. Um, hello. Hello, everyone. Episode 12. Hey. Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. Episode 12. I never remember the number, so somebody else can. Dang. Tell yeah, we're getting up there. Um, why doesn't everybody go ahead and introduce their characters for anybody who <coughs> hasn't been watching before or anybody who needs reminders? Sure. I'm playing, um, I'm playing a human magus <coughs> named Batsorig Tayang. He goes by Tayang. He's a level one. He goes by and, Batsor. And he's going to be <laughs> dragged along by his, uh, by his fellow, uh, Pathfinders. Nose hairs. Mm -hmm. What? Uh, my character is Oliknot. He is a Wayang, um, and he's a Unchained Rogue, Knife Master. My character is Ramul Hantaba. He is a human sorcerer of the uh, Path of Destiny. And an all-around nice guy who everyone loves to love. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, my character sure. is uh, uh, <laughs> Helen Eskian. She is an Unchained Barbarian. She's... Um, about 18 years old, 5'6", uh, long blonde hair, shaved on the side, on one side, and she carries a massive greatsword and has um, a nobleman's armor. Shinsaku Kanade is a level 3 bard, a male kitsune, silver hair, bright blue eyes, and a mischievous grin. Adorned with leather armor with touches of her tamer's guard and colorful jewelry and medals. Carries a light crossbow... What else does he carry? A dagger and a wand. Davern, tallest man alive. An <laughs> aging human fighter with a nodachi. <laughs> well, you're taller than I am. <laughs> yeah, tallest man alive. <laughs> He's about 5'9". Hmm. Okay. So tall. Um, so I'm checking one thing really quickly before Helen's we start. Harder than you. Um, is there but, any purchases or anything people needed to do before we get going? She's not a man. I don't think so. Uh, Already uh, done. She's yeah, also short. I think we're all okay. Um, yes. <clears throat> I'm good. I am considering some scroll buying. Do you remember how much scrolls mm -hmm. cost? And or wait, are scrolls on the um on the things we can buy oh, with just cash? Zero, zero in first level scrolls. Considering mm. buying some she some scrolls of if shield. You, if you wanted to buy a zero level scroll. I'd like to remind everybody that has one of those uh, uh, faction sheets to go ahead and open theirs up so that way they can keep an eye on what stuff might be applicable. I did point. say I was going to look at that before the session. I didn't. It's easy, Jeff. Don't worry. A Jeff, level one scroll cost there's a lot of words, but there's also pictures. But Thank there's you. no audio book to it. Oh. Rory, um, I'm going to buy some level <laughs> one scrolls, if that's okay. Yeah. Cool. I, I've been doing that pretty much as my only... <laughs> Can I get the faction um, sheet read by James Marsters? I'm going to buy uh, <laughs> scrolls of... James Marsden? Not James Marsden. Uh, Shield? Jimmy Stewart? Two scrolls of I'm shield. Star. Faction journal cards, as read by Oscar the Grouch. <laughs> as read by Wario. Wow! <laughs> God damn it! Not that helpful wasn't at all. I'm a voice actor. <laughs> okay, guys. So we're having an interesting scenario tonight for the first time with this. I was in here for the first it time. Is how this we is a first interesting at scenario. That, I'm we're so exactly glad. at an um, average party level of 2.5, which means you as a group decide if you want to do this at APL 1 2 or APL 3 4. This is a 1 this is a 1 to 7 module, so there's actually a distinction between 1 2 3 4 and 5 to 7. Uh, I'm so scared of TPK. You basically <laughs> choose to do easy mode or do hard mode for greater rewards. Mm. Honestly, I'm not. I'm not that picky. Yeah. I am buying scrolls of shield for a reason. I'll go I see. Whatever. Hold on. This is not the module yet, right, Rory? 
No, this is not the module yet. I this say is a we, scenario. I say we coast this one, get our levels, <laughs> and, then let's, and then we'll really the And the Halloween session. Brave and bold, but I also accelerated. That's like what I, can, right I can tell you that rewards do significantly increase at higher tiers. Yeah, I'm just saying, I like, do want that's better better rewards. if you don't have level three plus characters to go in. I think that we can do it though. I want the rewards. If I die, I'm willing to play a pre-gen. If you guys want to do the high one, I'll do it. If you want to do the low one, I'm fine with coasting. Yeah, honestly, I will, I will go either way. I'm just giving my advice. We've if got... I die, I'm going to remake Mavro, and I'm just going to play him. <laughs> he dies in three more levels. Hey, if we all have, have to a play as, if we all have to play as pre-gens uh, next week, that's fine. <laughs> I think that we. I think it, 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 Normally at 2.5, okay. uh, in um, more modern Pathfinder play, uh, they don't have 1 to 7 scenarios anymore. They have oh, this one is an older okay. scenario. This is an older one. So they don't run to this uh, thing. A 2.5 would go into the 1, 2, um, not go up to the 4 or 5. They did that specifically for that. With the 1 to 7 range, they have three tiers of play, and that's why it, it, the breakdown is on a slightly different level than normal. Okay. Hmm. It seems risky with level one, but um... he is a Magus. Maguses are, are one of the more broken classes. Boy, that is. I'm glad that you say that, but it does not. Really <laughs> any, um... I don't know. Have you had Have you had very much experience with level one Magus? Right? I don't know. Where I am not very broken. Set seven in the chat said, "Go big or go home." So I think we have to succumb to peer pressure on this one. Right. Uh oh. Hey Brit, if you're wondering, I have like. I'm, I'm willing four... to go big. I think I've got like four or five extra like daggers that I just used to throw. I'm just gonna loan you one. Does and anyone I... not have a wand? Because I've got a bunch of cure wounds charges if we need them. I have a wand with uh, the... I have I have a completely full wand. Somebody My wants to wand hand off is the wand 80 percent full because this is not the wand that was used on Hell Knight when um, Conrad died. <laughs> this is the wand that was used on the other Hell Knight when we almost TPK'd the, the Silken Caravan. I think, it's, it I think we're doing high level, Rory. Oh. Okay. Oh, shit. I'm, TPK, if, if, that, GG. if that is the consensus of the group, I am more than happy to accommodate it. Jeff is, Jeff is succumbing to peer pressure. I, <laughs> to I, I blame thing. set seven. A That's significant it. Significant higher rewards. <laughs> 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 I'm also going to buy like, a scroll of a it. Well, at least it's all on record that I advised a wise <laughs> route. Yep, you did. I'm with Richard. But that's okay. I mean, I'm okay with working hard. For this. With that's all fine. due respect. No, that I know what that means. He works hard for the money. <laughs> so uh, everyone is decided we're okay with this? Yeah. yeah. Just me wish I would have bought a cloak of resistance plus one instead of saved my money. But sure, right. we'll you can make a purchase now if you would prefer. Uh, no, it's fine. I'm sticking to my knives on this. I one. spent all my money, Rory. Oh, well then yeah. you can't make a purchase now. Yeah, no. Oh, wow. uh, unless you, you probably did spend you did, about all your money. You did make a purchase for a rather good set of armor, though, right? Mm. Your masterwork with... full plate, yo. Four. It went up quite a bit, didn't it? Four points. Hot stuff. That ain't bad. Damn. Twenty percent miss chance right there. I can make my armor class go up by four <laughs> points. Mm. Well, I'm also buying tanner. <laughs> I'm too dumb for spells, so. <laughs> Moving along. You're dumb. So dumb. <laughs> Please your call. Too dumb to go buy armor from a store. <laughs> <laughs> Are you uh, ready to hear a, a wall of text? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Uh, do I need to be finished with my purchases ahead of time? It said it put these cards in my store, but I uh, can't find them. But could go ahead. Okay. Venture Captain Drendel Drang's pinched face is hard to see from behind the stack of books that divide the front of his <laughs> office from be uh, the space behind his desk. A shockingly old man with white hair and slightly milky eyes, he is surprised by the appearance of outsiders in the office and looks up, half startled and half relieved. Thank you for coming on such short notice. I had been meaning to give this assignment to you at a later date, and with less pressing time constraints, but it seems that time has conspired against us. Drang mumbles to himself as he passes out, out a stack of notes and maps from behind the wall of books. These, are, these notes are from a recent chronicle. It contains some interesting finds, but one of them is now the utmost priority to the society. 
Rang lightly taps a bony finger on a map, on which can be seen a section of Absalom with a small corner townhouse circled in a deep red ink. This townhouse is a facade for an underground vault, the vault belonging to an old noble family of Absalom that was expelled a decade ago, the Declans. The family was forced out when their patriarch, a man named Arias, was discovered to have written documents detailing the city's defenses, documents he intended to hand over to the hostile forces loyal to Cheliax. The Chronicle indicates that a copy of these documents exists within the vault. A pathfinder looking into the Declans and their Chronicle reference is in the Chel in Cheliax was attacked and killed ten days ago. The thugs made off with a copy of his notes. Fortunately, he had already sent us another. We have reason to believe it was the work of the Declan's oldest child, a young woman named Selena, and she, she's the reason this assignment is now urgent. And the fact that Selena and her forces were willing to kill a Pathfinder for this information shows how desperately they were to retrieve the documents. If she were able to get these documents and return them to Cheliax, it would undermine the defenses of the whole city, as well as cause the society undue headaches. Find Selena, find the documents in her vault, and prevent the situation from turning into one big mess for the society. Hmm. Richard, you're up. Um, okay, so <laughs> I missed some of it, but there's a vault that we need to go into. By the way, the name of this module is the Infernal Vault. Okay, <clears throat> then yes, we have to go into a vault. And there's a woman named Selena that is uh, possibly murdered a Pathfinder, but they don't know for sure it was her. Is that correct? They strongly suspect it was her. Right, so she's a suspect, but that just means that she's guilty. And so then, this is a murder mystery. Well, it's it's a uh, claim documents. So you if, know, if we need to um, solve the murder to claim the documents, then so be it. But every murder is a mystery until you find out who did it. Yeah. Whoa, Confucius. You ever? You guys ever see that show? Um, uh, Rick and Morty, where they have the short mystery murders or whatever, murder mysteries. I have not oh, seen that's Rick and so Morty. great. That's pretty funny. <laughs> Anyways, <clears throat> so yeah, it sounds like we need to, uh, it sounds like we need to go to Cheliax. Are we in Cheliax? No. Already? Um, the, uh, the, uh, I thought he said it was in Epsilon. The Declan's family is a Cheliaxian family living in Epsilon. Oh, and uh, then, okay. They were... Because we needed to go into an infernal vault, that that's where it was gonna be, <laughs> and it was like, oh boy. <clears throat> okay, so we're in Absalom. We're gonna we're gonna look into this family, get into their vault, get some documents. Right. So the their the, there's an old house in Absalom that they were supposedly have a vault at. Uh huh. And you know where the the house is. Uh, uh, Oliknot would like to roll a knowledge local about that. About the house? About the house and the family. But the family is a knowledge nobility. Okay. I well, Let me check if I have that. I may not. Uh, I do not. Mm -hmm. I would like to roll knowledge nobility if that's the case. Sure. To find out more about the deck. Books. May I still no. do the local? For you the can. House? Okay. You also are still in Drang Drangle Drang's office. That's fine. Okay. Uh, this is to see if I know more than what he just told us. That's horrendous. You kind of heard the name Declan, but you don't remember where. Um, is, was that 17 your knowledge local? Mm -hmm. um, piecing things together, Richard, you realize that that house has been probably owned by a, a different family's name. So it was kept in secret by this family. Mm. But um, you don't know anything else relevant from that um okay here's another strange thing uh am i able to roll d knowledge dungeoneering to know something about an infernal vault nope okay it was worth a shot i haven't been able to roll that yet wait did he say did he say the words infernal vault nope oh, okay okay then good. uh pretend that i didn't mention that <laughs> everything about Cheliax is infernal that is yes true. when you hear Cheliax, uh, you might think infernal is going to happen Shinsaku. And you might also consider having religious uh, knowledge for anything to <laughs> deal with them. Do you think you'll be able to decipher these documents when we recover them? Uh, if it's right in Infernal, I probably won't. You don't need to decipher the documents, just get, bring them back to the Pathfinders. Mm. Good. Make sure that they don't get to Chelyax and bring them back to the Lodge. Well, I'm okay with this. Sure, sounds easy enough. Stop, Selena. 
Okay. Find the documents. Don't let the situation get worse. But if she starts singing bitty bitty bomb bomb, we're screwed. No, we'll make it. I have no idea what you're talking about. You guys are so uncultured, man. Since, I understand your silly email, folks. Since it's a, <laughs> since she's the suspect for the murder, is it better if we bring her back with us too, alive? If possible, of course. The society does not like bloodshed. But if we uh, otherwise would lose our chance. If she needs to, if if you need to stop her, um, more directly. Stop her whatever way we need to. <laughs> If she forces our hand, if not, I mean, we can always just hit her with a sap until she's unconscious and drag just, her back. I just wanted to make sure if you wanted her to, to uh, pay justice. Sounds an awful lot like street uh, justice. All do time. you have any other questions for me? I think not. Nope. Do you no, have any I suggestions for us? Um, about what? How to complete this mission. Ah, uh, yes, um... <laughs> I'm very direct of you. Straightforward, I like it. Um, I, I, the chronicles don't say much about the vault directly. There's, there's, um, reportedly used to store a portion of the family's wealth. It was supposed to be ingeniously trapped when the Declans fled from Absalom. The family archives uh, held documents that sh where they should be stored. It should be right next to the family crypts in the lower levels, according to these chronicles. Well, that sounds all like news. Do you know anything about the Declans? Uh, the, the Declans. Um, Arias was a beloved Absalom nobleman until about ten years ago when he was forced out of the city. Rumors have it that Chalaxian agents threatened young Selena's life. Um, and Arias felt he had no recourse but to retain the city's defenses in order to save her. I can only imagine the hardships the man has had to endure for the safety of his family since he was forced to move back to Chelyax and had failed his mission. Um, I have a question for the GM, um, and not for the character. Uh, where are we? Like, where Absalom. is the... We're in Absalom, right? So this is, like, local. Yeah. Yes, you are in Absalom. Okay, I just wanted to make sure. Is a um, Chalaxian that was exiled or whatever and came here? Uh, no, other way around. He was a Galaxian who was living living in Absalom. Okay, he right. exiled from Absalom when he failed when he was caught turning over documents that and he had he to do. And then he left. He went and back to Chelyax. Went to Chelyax because he was exiled from Absalom. Gotcha. And he was caught being a traitor to Absalom. Was he the only one who left, or did the rest of his family go with? His him? entire family was exiled. And Selena is presumably back and committing murders, or? Well, the Pathfinder had been in Chelyax when he died. That's dangerous. Pathfinders go everywhere. Well, I mean, just Chelyax is dangerous. <laughs> Do you think you can decipher the second set of documents? What second set of documents? He's Davin? talking to Shinsaku. <laughs> Do we need... Same answer? Any deciphering? Okay, if they're in Abyssal, I'll gladly tell you what they say. But if, if it's not. magic, I can read it. If it's in... Uh, if it's in Wayang, I can read it. Yes, you could. If we bring them what back is here, Yang, What does the Wayang alphabet even look like? I've I'll uh, start using my... Uh, I'm going to leave. I'm going to draw on a piece of paper some... <sighs> this is a rather urgent matter, so if you have no other questions... Davern, we'll cross I that would... bridge when we get there. How about that? I can read, too. No, it sounds can't. good Come to on. me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> with the map, it is not hard to find the house marked out on it. Here, Davern, you read the directions. I will yeah, do I'll so. Start heading in that direction. Sure. Is there anything you'd like to do on the way over, or are you going to head straight there? Uh, um, <laughs> I would like to. Uh... Well, I have a flail and a longsword. That's a pretty good uh, starting point. Um, of course you do. <laughs> I guess but the, you got to be prepared for undead. The house is is uh, supposed to be nominally in the holding of another family. Uh, it, it. Are you asking him before you leave, or are you asking me? I mean, you mentioned it earlier. I was I was just a little confused by it. Uh, I think I I would just like to to 
try to kind of ask around in that neighborhood when we start getting close. If anybody has basically seen anything unusual happening in that house or that uh, neighborhood in the past day or two. Sure, you can do that. Roll a diplomacy check as you get close. Mm, that, uh... Um, if anybody wants to hand over their wands in the meantime. Sure, I will. Whoops, step, numlock. Hand over your wands. This is a stick up. There you go, good <laughs> sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, Davrin, always a joy. Yeah, uh, did I not already give you one and the dagger? If, if not, you can have them. You gave me your dagger, but we were still discussing charges issue with it. So. Oh, no, I'm saying you can use it. I got plenty of charges. Then Shinsaku will have the Jubilee of Wands at the right. <laughs> once again. In return, I would be Thanks glad to comb your shoulder hair. I'm to take my wand. Say that what again. The rest of her hair? His. His. Why are we... So what now? Um, I'll hold on to my wand. There's a chance slim enough that I'll be able to use it in combat, but um, post-combat, you'd be a lot more reliable. But that's all right. Um, Rommel, you have the 14 on diplomacy? That yeah. Good? Yeah, you... Um, they can inform you that it's been abandoned for a long time, that no one's li lived there. Um, recently, they heard some noises from it again. Okay. Is there any reason that nobody bought it, or nobody? Well, it was owned. Oh, it it's was just... owned and abandoned. It was owned and abandoned. Yes. Okay, that's weird. Um, is there a way to find out who uh, who owns it, or was it like a fake sort of thing? Um, it's a family that does not matter. Huh. As Fair in, enough. they did they did not give me a name. And so it will not be important to this. <laughs> I'm okay with this. They said it was being held under a false name. The Bradys. Mm. Uh, Bunch of Bradys they got. Well, um, anything else you wanted to do on the way over? Um, uh, I need to see if protection know. from evil is on my spell list. It's not. <laughs> I'll cast some mage armor on myself uh, from a wand. Ooh, sure. Are you doing that as you get up to the house, basically? Yeah, probably once I'm in the neighborhood getting close yeah. to it. I'm going yeah. to uh, use a wand as well that I'm going to have to roll to see if it activates. <laughs> Excuse Which me. wand? I might be able to activate it for you. Oh, uh, is Long Strider something that um, people can do? Long Strider's on my oh, uh, Actually, I'm not sure. And yeah, also, I guess it's not on my list. It's not, not on, on my spell list. Wand? Wanda Sykes. Uh, just to make oh, sure, it I think is. Of, I think long thread might be cell phone. It is personal. Oh, yeah. Okay, never mind. Don't bring Thank her you for into the this. Back. I'm so glad Davern will wear armor on himself. All right, here we go. It's great. I'm so proud. <laughs> Boom! Got it. On one charge. All over on himself. <laughs> oh, this! All oh. over this. Any anything else? Nope, I think I not. No, okay. moving at the speed of normal human people is fine with me. Speed of efficiency, somewhat. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you you didn't find someone who rolled it yourself, Oliknut, right? No, I did it myself. Awesome. I um, am am done. I have my scrolls, my spells, my potions. I am finishing one thing up because I had it prepared for one two, and I'm making sure I get the tokens right. Yeah, does anybody know anything we should buy from the store? Um, dealing with devils. This would be my first time dealing with devils. So Rory, can I think sure. of anything dealing with devils that we would need specifically? Knowledge planes. Holy water. Sure. Holy water, I suppose. Twenty-seven. Devil. Devils are evil. Twenty-seven. Devils are evil. They're an evil extra planner species, uh, group. There's lots of different types. They have lots of different things about them. 27 is a very good roll. You would know that uh, <coughs> cold iron, silver, and silver, silver and silver. good are the things that you'll primarily need to break. Their you both of them? Depends on how strong a demon you're fight or devil you're fighting. Mm. Hmm. Um... I can see. I'm pretty sure sil silver sheen is prohibitively expensive. Uh, do I know anything about their elemental resistances out of curiosity? Is it cold, fire, lightning? 
I don't remember off the top of my head, sorry. I'm pretty sure they vary wildly, but they're almost all resistant to or immune to a couple of things. Um, I can check quick if there is a devil um, entry that I can give you something quickly from. Um, Silver Sheen is 250 gold. Yeah. And it lasts... Uh, Gives the weapon the proper fire and poison resistance to acid and cold. Mm -hmm. Um, well, I can't beat that on the regular. I mean, so immune to fire and poison resistant to acid and cold this is what devil subtype gives. Sure, they're also lawful evil. No, that is what you would that's... know about devils. Just because Cheliax is infernal doesn't mean that there will be devils. We're not going to Cheliax, but we are going to a vault. I didn't realize this. Uh, silver or alchemical silver weapons only take the damage penalty if they're slashing or piercing. Yeah, I didn't know that either. Mm -hmm. Until I looked Local at it. Silver bludgeoning weapons don't take that penalty. Um, so I'm going to. I think I'm going to. Um, do you have to. Rory, do you know if you have to do anything special other than just spend an action to. Put alchemical silver on with silver sheen. Like, no, it's, it's not like a UMD or anything like that, no, right? It, it's an action. Okay. I, I, I'm, my attacks don't matter enough. I believe um, it for what it's matter for what it's worth, Richard. It's probably cheaper for you just to buy a silver deck. Is all of this out of game, or are you guys talking about any of this in game? No, a silver, I mean, a I mentioned... silver light weapon costs twenty gold extra. Uh, good point. You know what? I'm just gonna get two. It's silver. really cheap to get a silver dagger, or really? a silver light mace. Yeah, or a silver light mace, which is what I'm probably just going to buy. Mm. Um, uh, yeah. You know what? I'm gonna. I don't know if I really want one of those. How much is a silver dagger? <laughs> a a silver dogs. dagger costs oh, whatever a dagger costs. A Twenty-two like... gold. A silver light mace is twenty-five. I'm buying a silver uh, light mace. Fuck it. Yeah, I'll get a silver dagger. A silver light mace does not suffer the so, damage penalty. To answer so your question, right. Jeff, you guys are currently buying silver weapons. Oh, so. yeah. Devron will pull out a silver dagger. I have this. Well, that'll help. It has, a, you, it has a hole near the uh, base of the uh, blade. Uh, all right. Uh, all right good, good job, buddy. Does good anyone, need, does anyone need to use this? You might need to use it if... Um... I believe people can roll knowledge with on that also, if Jeff wants to tell them more. That is true. Uh, I don't know shit about it, and my religion is bad. I was present for the conversation about it, but I <laughs> don't know anything as Oleg not. Doesn't right, well, like anybody cares, so we'll move on. Um, mm -hmm. I will keep my dagger. Cool. Okay, um, so you guys will arrive at the townhouse. Do I need a, Do I need to get a silver greatsword? Can you even? You, you can. can. Um, a silver two-handed weapon costs 180 gold more than the regular cost. Oh, if it's... no. no. However, a silver <laughs> a silver light weapon, like a light mace or something like that, um, only costs 20 gold extra. And um, if you get a, bludgeoned we a bludgeoning weapon, it doesn't take the negative one damage penalty than normal silver. Flash you're or likely to encounter... A robust enough damage reduction that Helen won't be better off swinging a non-silver greatsword. Yeah, I'm pretty sure um, that Helen and Davrin are going to be fine on that. The knack for breaking damage reduction by just breaking. Can are I... you guys doing anything else? Uh, I think there's silver arrows I could get, or silver bolts too, yes? Yes? Mm -hmm. I think they're two gold each. Then I might grab a couple of those. It's two gold for... Okay. Yeah, You're I'm gonna, gonna grab some of your silver weapons. Um, how much is holy water? That's a lot. I don't know. Like 25 or 50? I can't remember. No, it can't be more than 25. Can it? I don't remember. Oh, damn. I, I will let you guys look up the prices of things that you're buying. Sorry, Rory. We don't no, no, not, not problem. No problem at all. Holy water is uh, better safe than sorry in this case, but a lot. It's not holy <laughs> symbol in holy, holy water. Mm. Damn it. All right, holy water costs twenty-five. Uh. Class. 
and okay. it basically damages undead evil outsiders. Okay. So and it's a splash button. Yep. So you guys are buying some holy water then? Yeah. Like? The thing is, is that our pay is going up so much for doing this that I don't want to screw it over by sure. not giving what, it the due diligence. Do whatever you feel is necessary to prepare for this module. All right. All right. So I'm spending 75 on two holy waters. <laughs> <man> and, uh... <laughs> Wait, I'm uh, glad someone caught it. 25 a piece, I thought. What's that? Aren't holy waters 25 a piece? Yeah, yes. 25. I'm spending 75 by buying two holy waters and a silver light mace. Gotcha. Okay. And you guys are good to go? Yes. I've spent like 200 gold so far. <laughs> okay. So I also you, you arrive at the townhouse. Love it. This, What's it look like? Um, Abandoned? I'm waiting for the block text. I was trying to preempt it. Sitting on the corner oh, of a quiet geez. street, the red brick Declan townhouse melds in with the middle class buildings in this portion of Absalom. A small flickering candle can be seen through a barred window on the building's west side, and a single door can be seen on the building's south face. Shinsaku should check out the barred window. The which window? I'm sorry. <laughs> he said a barred window. No. Oh. Like barred. Got it. Barred hmm. <laughs> I'm very clever. Sucker you are currently in the east gate of the district of Absalom on the quiet east side. Is so it, uh, how many stories is it? Single story. It is a, a small building. So, uh, what's the land like? Does it have like a wall around the building or is it just standing out in the middle? It's on the corner of a street. Mm -hmm. um, so you see there's a building attached to it on the north side, but there's open space on the other side. I propose that we go in like we own the place. Because whoever is in there, sure doesn't. Sure, uh, Rory is the. Uh, is there like a gate? Nope. Is the old not. Um, oh, do you know anything almost. about traps? Yeah. You mentioned devious traps, I believe. Or yeah, I gotta look for traps a lot. Yeah. Um, gonna... I'll, I'll shoot you. I'll shoot you a glance that that says, "I'm sorry about this." <laughs> yeah, I'll look not all shrug because this is the life of a rogue. Um, he's going to. Uh, take a look at the door, and if you didn't describe the door already, I missed it. Um, you should put yourselves on the map where you are standing. I am not um, even on the tabletop. It's the, the bottom part where the door is? Yes, the map is actually uh, orthorectified correctly to north. Okay, Thank I'm going to stand. Wrote. I didn't ask I would like to. Was... I would like to search for traps. Okay. And I'm, and I'm probably going to ask that a lot, so I'm sorry if that gets annoying. No, no, that is totally fine. I understand when you are specifically told this module might traps. have a lot of uh, devious traps in there. <laughs> oh, just like straight out the gate, I'm going to cast a check poison on the door because I have it, and it, uh, it doesn't cost me anything. To also, do it. It, doesn't, if the, actually, it doesn't hurt to, to detect magic. I can just open close mm -hmm. things with a flick of a wrist, too, as long yeah, as there's no luck. Olek not, you determine that the door is not locked and there is a trap. Um, okay. May can I... I sense that there's any poison? There is not poison on the door. May I poisonous? use disabled um, device to deal with the trap? Olek not, you find a small string of thread on the top part of the door. It looks like if the door opens, it will pull on the thread. You should... I'll, uh, I'll point it out. Uh, you guys, you guys might want to back up just in case. Can you just <laughs> nail the thread up on, to the... on unlocked doors, or is it just like smaller uh, containers? Look, and guys, I don't know. Um, I know when we did Jeff's game, uh, it was it was one thing, but I know basically in Pathfinder, a lot of times you're just making a disabled device check on a trap that you recognize. Uh, Rory, how do you want to do this? Do you want me to actually try to describe how I'm dealing with the trap? Because Oleknot probably knows more about dealing with traps than Richard does. If you want to just say, I, I'm trying to disable it, that is fine. If okay. you think you have a good way of bypassing a trap, sometimes you can do it without a disabled device check or gain a bonus that would be appropriate. Okay. Um, I, I'm so, gonna... like, for, for example, in one game, there was a pit trap, and we built a bridge over it effectively with right. furniture. If you had a stable gun, you could probably disabled, stable the string to the top of the door. Way around it. Disabling... I guess, like Shinsaku said, he has open clothes, which should work for unlocked doors. 
I would say you should try to disable it first, just in case it includes some kind of uh, noise making component that would warn people of us coming. Hmm. But if you can't disable yeah, it, you disable should that. just I'll stand back and pop it. Yeah, you think that it's based off of pressure on the string as it goes taut, and that clipping it would not cause a problem, and you clip the string and nothing happens. All right. You think you have disabled the track. All right. Well. I'm going to say, um, you're confident in this, right? As long as you're confident in it, I'm confident in it. I'm going to open the door without even looking in the room. Uh. <laughs> you get shot in the back. <laughs> Are you opening the door? like, oh, I'm sorry. About the crossbow trap. What was that? Yeah. No, I opened the door. You open the door. You have to be adjacent to the door. To oh, open. sorry. Yep. And Shinsaku is waiting 30 feet down the street on the other side. Oh, I'm yeah. sorry. It, yes. It's fine if that's what you wanted to do. I just wanted to double check. I was on my character sheet for a while, so... I yeah. am waiting a little ways Ooh. away. Okay. Um, you see a... It's a small house. There's an, a short entry hall opening on two sides into different rooms. Um, as you open the door, you see a head peek around the corner of a man lo who looks in and seems... It's in a red circle. And team surprised to see you, and you can roll initiative. Yes! Aww. I knew it. I could try to charm him. Couldn't dead, I? Dead timing, though. Good right. job, Jeff. Yeah. I had to get my dinner. Right. Uh, I had to turn to the order. There we go. Hey! 15. I don't know about you. Whoop, whoop! I'm no feeling 19 this <laughs> Did it look like a normal Suck man, it, or did it look like something that was not a man? It looks like a guy. He looks like a man. This is a guy. He is wearing armor. He has <laughs> a weapon. Um, I'm ashamed. You can roll knowledge local. Did he make any sound? He no, like aside from into our house. I mean, yeah, he makes noise. But he is not totally totally sad. Sixteen. On <laughs> I, I, I just meant like like is he did he say anything like like hey or oh god. He's a hologram. He's not yet. Get him. Uh, um, my sixteen was for knowledge local. Uh, you recognize him as part of the Devil's Claw mercenary group, which are effectively a group of failed Hell Knights that work in Chelyax sometimes. Um, sure. I've got a quick question for you. you can call them Heck Knights, maybe? <laughs> those, those Heck Knights. Um, are they considered to be known slavers? No. Okay, I had to ask. For the shot, man. Can I ring shot. every last drop? Okay, Oliknock, you are first. Uh, sure. Um, <laughs> is going to let's see. I want to change that music. Oleg not is not a hero, but he's going to try to get a sneak attack. He's going to go one, two, three. This would would he be considered having cover from where he's standing if I move to this spot? No. What? If I move to this spot, will he be considered to have cover? Uh yes. Okay. But he is flat-footed because we surprised when we came through the door? Yes. Okay. I'm going to take a shot then. I'm going to attack him. <sighs> uh, let's see. Fucking <laughs> wild arms. <laughs> no, I love the is wild arms. Go ahead, Jeff. Do the motion. I'm sorry, Rory? Is this a bad song to choose for the oh, Rudy. <laughs> no, this is awesome. Uh, does 25 hit? It does. Oh my god, your attack rolls are so high. Well, that's you'd, a single... That's you'd be single. really upset if that had if that not, uh, not hit, right? I would be very upset because I'd be like, guys, we shouldn't have gunned this level here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Lower the difficulty on the fly. Okay. One. Can we just go home? <laughs> this ain't no PS4. Lily won't go home. Ah, no! Uh, six damage. Okay, you will take it. He's not dropped. And that is the end of my turn. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Who's next? I think it's me. What are you I'm doing? That sound of Rommel. Um. Da, 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 da. I'm gonna walk. Yeah, you guys just saw. I'm going to charge give the touch room. of destiny to Helen, and I'm done. <laughs> Shinsaku. I love that Rommel's a level 3 okay. wizard, or level 3 sorcerer, who still spends a fair amount of time giving touches. I'll step up thing. into the door, and I'm going to start uh, inspiring courage. Okay. Helen? Helen is going to move here and rage. <laughs> Go right there. 
and then she's gonna. And your uh, pluses, attack. sir. It's really plus unfortunate one. that this guy. Plus one. Plus one. Plus one. Plus one. Next level, it'll be a plus two. <laughs> Helen, you can see there's another man yeah! who I have now. Okay, let me see where this man is. You look like a right. man. <sighs> yeah, I was ashamed when I made that joke. Okay. <laughs> no, we've embraced it now. I'll ever reach <laughs> okay. level seven. I think that's how most things from Mad TV got popular, <laughs> is that people broke through their shame. Okay. I'm also going to um, power attack, probably. Go for it. This is why I like barbarians. This is why, this is why I like bard bar bar barbarian oh. combos. Barbarian. <laughs> Dude, I considered making a skull. Like, I am okay with doing a power attack because I'm getting a bonus from another source. I'm okay doing a power attack even if I'm not getting bonuses. Don't I? I just like power You should attack. not be okay with doing power attacks at your level. I don't have power attack. So nice. 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 Sweet! You should not be doing power attacks at your level. 15 to confirm? <laughs> that does not confirm. Oh. Yeah. Oh, God. Okay. What a bummer. <coughs> Look at that. That made Ed so mad he left. <laughs> it's like, guess we're not chopping any butts tonight, and he left. It did. It, you did hit him, though. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think every enemy should have a magic number. Uh, 15 damage. Um, yep, 15 damage. He does not drop. <gasps> oh, okay. Young. <laughs> Good thing I did not try days on him then. He's taking a lot of damage. Taeyong is leaving. No, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Taeyong is going to. Oh, no, it's two more damage. Shit, I knew I was missing something. Okay. I got it. Yep. Taeyang is going to, um... Ca uh, he's gonna make his weapon magical. A swift action? Sure. That's what I missed. Then he's gonna go... Uh, hold up. Five, Twenty. These are hard corners, right? Yeah. <laughs> Hardcore. Uh, there's... Okay. All right, I'm gonna move here, and I'm gonna attack him through cover. Okay. This is sad. Oh, I don't hit. I'm done. You can make Should a perception power. check, Lee. Hmm. Pretty sure this is also sad. Nine. Okay. Davern? Alright. <clears throat> I'm gonna clog the hallway. Can I assist Oliknot? Yeah. Yeah? I will do that. Giving a bonus to hit or bonus to AC? I need to be next to a target for him to get a bonus to hit, right? Yes. So, AC. Okay. This guy's gonna move up to here. <gasps> um, he's going to flank power attack. No! Helen is... Helen. They have the a long sword in the shield, by the way. 13. I hope you're not considering buying a magic weapon, Ebo, because you should buy a magic armor. Does 14 hit you? He's been sitting on a lot of money, I think. Yeah, 14 hits me. Okay. Seven damage. The other Eight. one is going to flank power attack you. That also hits. Four or five damage. I take a bit of that. You guys hear a thump, like kind of clunk noise. <laughs> Olic nut? No, I think I Wait, from was. where? You could make a perception check. Hmm. I think I know what's happening. Hey, Rory, um, can I ask this... a, a question about the rules? You may ask. Um, am I able to um, pass? Even though those are hard corners, am I able to pass using the enemy square, but but uh, risk an attack of opportunity as a small creature? You can attempt to make a tumble check to pass through an enemy square. Yeah, I want to do... If, if you uh, fail, you will not... You will not pass through, and you provoke an attack of opportunity. Correct. Fail. You shall not pass. And it's it's acrobatics? It is acrobatics, and it is a harder DC based off of their CMD. Uh, but do you get a bonus? Cause, does he get a bonus because he's smaller than them? 
I don't believe so. Okay. That was well, the two really science six. categories lower, uh, lower for that to be easy. What is the measure of a man anyway? To see his enemies driven before him. So, um, Richard, oh, sure. five five plus their CMB is the number you'd be going through. For so it's five higher than normal. Um, and it looks like the probably looking for like a eighteen or nineteen to tumble through their square. Yeah, I mean, my I, hunch. I can hit that uh, fairly <laughs> easily. It, eh, screw it. I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna try to tumble past the one on the right. Nope, fourteen. That's there's no way that hits it. That does not. Okay. So then you can't move. Okay. And through their square, and he will attack you. Now, do I get cover because of the corner that I didn't get to move past? No, and technically, though I'm not going to rule it this way, you would be squeezing in Helen Square. <laughs> oh, okay. Because that would be the square you would stop your movement in, but I know what you were trying to do, so I'm not going to enforce that. Okay. Bum, bum, bum. 18 um, hit you? It does not. Okay. It would normally, but Deverin gave me some AC. Okay. Deverin's helping. So that ends your movement from the turn. Yes. And then I will attack. Okay. So he will have cover from you, but I'll factor that on my end. And he's no longer flat footed. Correct. And we got Bard Song right now? Sure do. Oh, I forgot to add my plus one. It's all right, I rolled a one, but. Does oh, 22 hit? Exactly. Yay. Wow. There's no Pretty way that's exactly. <laughs> what do you mean? Exactly ain't hitting anything. <laughs> I did. I did three damage to the. If their AC is 22. I'm going to be giving Helen AIDS for the rest of the fight. Yep. Uh, are you, he took it? Are you done? Um. Yes. I'm passing to Rommel. Okay. All right. <clears throat> Never mind. I was going to ask a question that I couldn't possibly know the answer to. Um, oh, stop. <coughs> going to move over here. And I, I can I see the either of them? I guess. Like, I think technically you can see them in D and D terms. They would have nine ten cover from you. That's cool. But... I'm gonna cast magic missile on the one on the right. <laughs> there you go. Okay. I'll show you and... what cover ones means. Okay. Oh, nice. And he's not dropped. Shinzaku. Uh... <laughs> oh, these we can wonderful. move through people in this case. But... <coughs> Can't but be you can in the move same to your spot. teammates, but you have to tumble if you're going to move past an enemy. And it's very difficult to do, so I don't recommend it, because you just saw one of the most agile creatures you've ever seen uh, fail that. Um, Shin Shinzaku is a fox. Yes, I am. I'm just saying, mm -hmm. she might be a fox, but she's not a little shadow gnome thing. <laughs> shadow no. gnome? Yeah. I thought you were like a rat person. You know no. what? Well... Mind you, just start. Lingering performance is active right now. But yeah, I think I'm going to try and roll through it. Why the fuck not? Well, okay. Because they hit you if you don't. Here's, here's the next thing. I know. Thing, I'm well aware. Here's the next thing. What's your, what's your movement? 30 normally? Mm hmm. Because you can only move 15 feet if you're tumbling. And I'm still outside. Yes. Okay. Richard, you so, don't have to tumble for your entire movement. Only the squares with which you are tumbling. I, that's fine, but 5, 10, 15, 20, and then, well, nope, it's a hard corner. You still wouldn't be able to make it. Yeah. Right. Oh, I fucking hate Pathfinder rules on that uh -oh. shit. Me. <laughs> uh, fuck it. Uh, I can't see anything or do anything at this point, so I'm just going to crowd the hallway, lingering yeah, performance is active, let's and go. Building up. I'm going to pass from here. All right. <laughs> Helen? Helen's going to auto attack the guy on the right. <laughs> chop, <laughs> chop, chop, chop. <laughs> the power attack. Sure. Oh this. my god, 16 to hit. That does not hit. <laughs> Tayang? I am going to. Oh, I didn't have Touch of Destiny anyway, so it would have been. Uh, uh, aid Helen's AC. Okay. Thanks, mate. Alright. And that's it. Also, I'm going to say, hey, what was that noise? 
Davrin? Uh, I guess I'll aid uh, Olek not AC. Okay, they're going to flank power attack Helen. I don't want it. Does a 15 hit Helen? Yes. Okay, then they will both hit Helen. What? You gotta do something about that boy. Yeah, I'm like, where's your armor, dude? 15? Well, he's, up, and he's a raging barbarian. What do you expect? I'm a barbarian. And he wants extra armor. movement speed, so he's wearing light armor instead of I'm, medium. I'm gonna try to do the same thing that I did last time. Okay. Which is tumble through. Sure. There's usually another person with me here. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, take your, take your attack. But I just almost rolled a d29. That's a 20 to hit you. Uh, that's exact. Or 12 points of damage. Yep, he'll take Ooh. it. Mm. That's hardcore. It is hardcore. I would move, but I also can. Uh, you can try to and push And I don't one. want to. You could try to push. Don't waste I don't time. mean to, you know, try to give you some <laughs> <Don't want> <laughs> That also provokes on oh, I'm sorry. Screen. Was I getting cover from the wall still? No, I am not giving them flanking. I'm not giving you cover. Okay, got it. I'm basically... I, I, I was not... Technically, you should be squeezing it. They're flanking you, They're and you're going one penalty for a different penalty. So I'm just not including any of that because yes. you'd be doing it out of Helen Square. Yes. You like stick an arm around the corner to see if you can make it through, and he swings at your arm, and you're like, maybe not. It's like who designs this freaking space anyway? Um, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna still attack. Like Somebody who expected to live here and not fight here, probably. <laughs> of course. There's no feng shui hit? in this place. It does. Nice. All their shui is feng. Super fun. Not this one. Five damage. Wait, was an 18 a threatened crit for you? Uh, no. Daggers? Oh, our, I thought daggers were no. 19-20. Yeah, Kukri or Scimitar. Or, All right. Or... Okay. Oh, did you kill him? Or... Yes, he dropped. Oh, should have attacked him first. Um. Shufta. You and me both, Jeff. That's a... Perfect. We can just have termites <laughs> sick them. Um, that's true. <laughs> that's why I haven't been constantly pestering my landlord about the termites. Uh, pestering, the pestering. Hold. <laughs> You're holding. Them in the plague yeah. A rat died in there last summer. Just okay. Kinkaku? I like to call him Mickey. Liquid performance is active, and since I really can't do anything here, you could try to aid. Oh, look, not say no. That's. Yeah. That's Davern. Whoops. Yeah, I can't gonna, aid either of them, so. I'm kind of stuck here. Are you holding? Yeah, why not? <sighs> um, Helen? Helen's gonna just, um, snick a snack -a in the back -a. Okay, power attack. It doesn't fail every time. Sure. 22 to hit. That will hit. Uh, 15 damage. Okay. Hot damn. Hot. This is a shitty hallway. Tyon? Okay, um... Let's burn this house down. <laughs> I'm not flanking anymore. I am going to... Oh, I'm gonna take a five-foot step. Ah. I am going to... <clears throat> um... Or try to hit him? Sure. Uh, is fighting defensively minus four or minus two to hit? Minus four to hit, plus two to AC. Gross. I'm just gonna hit him. <laughs> it's an Smack excellent him around. 16 hit? It does not. Alright then. Damn, man. I am uh, oh. stuck there. Tallest man alive. Moving up here. Okay. Tallest man alive. Do it! Okay. <clears throat> because it's around a hard corner, he does not get an attack an opportunity. Cool. And I'm going I'm to gonna take, take my turn after Davern, by the non way. Non-power attack. Damn it! Does 27 hit? Thank you. I wow. it does. It does. How about 26? 26. That hit. hits as well. Woo! All right, so 29. Get toasted. Holy moly! You kill him. <laughs> the tallest man alive. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna pat you on the shoulder and say, 
damn right you are. <sighs> okay, you have succeeded at your first level four encounter. Uh, I need to heal. Uh, what's his name? Mm, um, no, Olek not. No, I was gonna say um, Olek not and Helen are probably both badly wounded. Yeah, they're probably hurt. Um, I'm gonna say, sorry, did you guys mind holding still a moment, please? Did you really hear that thumping noise? I have an intuition about this. Yeah, I think it was my heart pumping. We're expecting to find some access to a place underground. Mm -hmm. Is it possible that one of you is standing on a trap door? And maybe somebody bumped their head I'll on I'll look it? around. Uh, that's good for now, honey. I'll take that. I'll say, um... um you can make a perception check if you want to search around. Tell me which room or hallway you're searching in. I'll, um, yeah, I'll start wandering, wandering around looking for her trap doors. I would like I'm going to search the room with the couch. I'd like to search the bodies of the dudes. Sure. Um, sweet, I got a three. Oh my god. Keep rolling fucking threes. Uh, I'm assuming we need to keep going. I got going. a three on a d20. Ty Young, you don't yeah. notice the thing, oh. anything out of ordinary. There looks like the two chairs there were um, where they were playing a dice game. You see a small pile of of assorted like coppers, cheap coinage, and two bottles on the table. But you don't notice anything else. I'll grab the bottles. Are sure. They just, are they just booze? Um, they've got a kind of oily liquid inside of them. I'm hmm. gonna cast attack magic. They are magical. Can I try to identify them? Sure. Uh, is Excuse that spellcraft? Yeah. Helen, how much HP do you need still? Do you need more heals? Uh, how many did you heal me for? Uh, so far, like six, because I keep rolling a fucking okay. two. I am... Yes, I need uh, uh, quite quite a bit see more. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to keep going, okay? You just tell me when to stop. Yeah. Four. Keep going. Five. Mm, keep going. No, nice. we're good. Okay. Can I get one more from mine? Okay, yep. so that was five of them. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm gonna say, um... It's fine, actually. I needed three. Uh, actually, nope. I do want to loot the guys also. Sure. Yes. The guys have, um... I need to do another Masterwork one. Masterwork Longsword. Uh, uh, whoop. Sure. Okay. They That's have Masterwork Chainmail. A heavy Steel Shield. Um, That's it. Uh, damn. Oh. Um... <laughs> I'm gonna search for traps. Where? Um, which room had the table in it? The table. You see the two, two, two chairs and the small table next to the window. Uh, yes. That is where it was. I'm gonna start with that room first. Sure. I'm gonna where say, yeah, I found some um, traps. Oh, I on was. Oil of blast weapon. I'm sorry. If I have to be more specific, I was gonna start with uh, under the table. I was. I guess I'm searching also if there's like a trap door. I would like to search the area right under where Tyong was standing. How many, how many top of the hall. checks do you want me to make? You can search the room for trap doors. That is different than searching an area for traps. Okay. Like, um, how big doors. is an area that I can search for traps? Like your immediate vicinity. I think they usually, okay. yeah, it's usually I'm just going to search the room for trap doors. Like secret doors. That's fine. Okay. Yep. And that I got an aid on that. And then I'm going to search specific sections like the table where I was at for traps. Sure. You're pretty sure there's no traps on the table because someone was sitting on it recently. Yeah, but I'm looking on the floor, though. Sure, you can look for secret doors, but do that first. Well, I did. I rolled an 8 on that. Yeah, you don't find any secret doors. Okay, then... Uh, Ed, you can make your search check if you haven't. I guess. Fourteen. You don't find any secret doors in the hallway. I'm going to go to the other room and do the same thing, Rory. Okay, you can search for secret doors. Boy, I wish I could pause. I'm gonna pass. Um, I'm gonna pass an oil of blessed weapon to Davrin and one to Helen also. Sixteen. Um, in the southeast corner, you find a old clothing chest that is slightly askew and is strangely empty. I would like to search it for traps. Sure. You notice that there is a trapdoor, kind of a false bottom trapdoor built into it. Yeah, I don't I don't want people to crowd this area till I've searched it for traps. Tactically speaking, when should I drink this? I well, got first an of all, for searching for tactically traps. Tactically speaking, do not drink it. 
is very bad for you. Tactically speaking, you don't find any secret. You right, rub it on your weapon. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna mention. Uh, <laughs> hey guys, I, I think I found the way down. Uh, and you rub it on your weapon when we're fighting a devil. Yeah, I rub it on your weapon when you're fighting a devil. Anyways, I found a trap. On the, I think it goes down from here. I gave nice. one to Helen also, for what it's worth. The sad holy water or whatever it's It's an oil of blessed weapon. Uh, Olkna's just going to open the trap door. Sure. You see a ladder descending downwards. Do you want me to go um, down if, first? Or do I you have to... some dark vision, 60 feet. Do I see. How far down do I see? 20, 30 feet down. What does it look like down there? Oh! Just lights. There are, I mean, dark vision doesn't matter because there are torches. Well, I, that wasn't said to me, so I just dark. assumed that it was dark. Right. It's not dark down there. It is a small room. You can't see much in the room because you're looking straight down. Sure. I'll say, um... Well, if you guys are done rubbing or whatever, I'm gonna head down. <laughs> I'll be behind Davern, then. Um, behind I'm Davern going... is my favorite place to be. Uh, I don't I'm see sure anything it is. other than that there's a couple in danger torches. Arrive, you perv. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, one second. Do I see anything else other than there's a couple torches? Uh, On the top? No. Okay, so... But I don't see any living beings in that room under me, right? From the top? No. You can make it a perception check, but you can't see much of the room. Okay, as I go down, I'll take a uh, perception check. It's in 11. Okay, yeah, you don't see anything down there. All right, I'm going to keep going. I'm going to okay. head down to the bottom. The ladder is not trapped, so you're fine. Okay. Um, um, when I get to the, the room. bottom, I'm going to just stand in the middle of the room and search the room while other people are coming down. Okay. Um, this small, stuffy square room was cut from the building's stone foundation. The room's east wall features a large stone mosaic that shows several faceless people worshipping at the top, others being condemned at the bottom, and no figures in the middle pattern. The mosaic contains a set of three identical circular indentations, one set within the top section, one in the empty center, and another within the bottom section. Illuminating the room are two lit torches and scars on the north and south walls. Do the torches have anything around them? You were making a perception check, I believe? Yes, 27. Um, the torches have nothing special about them, but you do find three stone discs on, uh, lying on the ground against one wall. Is there anything special about the stone discs if I go over to them? Uh, and they're face down. You'd have to pick them up. Uh, I'll pick one up. Ah, you see a stone that has a representation of a happy-looking female child. Uh, sure. If As long as people are still climbing down the ladder, I'm going to go and collect the discs. Okay. Yeah, I mean, they're like one-foot discs. That's fine. I just want to gather them up so we can look at all three of them. Yeah, so the three discs are a happy-looking... Um, female child, a grandiose city, and a brooding devil. Would you like to see how far I can throw one of these? <laughs> well, it's oh. not a very big room, so I think uh, you're gonna you're gonna smash all of our uh, all of our um, hopes and dreams. So, just to help, there's a little bit of a depiction of the door or wall section, the mosaic. If you scroll down just a little bit. I'm sorry. Oh, but, okay. Uh, oh. Ooh. Oh. Okay. So, so I guess we're supposed to put these in order. Uh, I don't know. The, uh, and Shinsaku is still not going down, right? She's staying up top? He is moving down with everybody. Okay. Um, uh, you should put yourself in the room then. What, can I the, check um, if okay. there's a, a trap on the door that has the mosaic? Sure. You can check for a trap on the door. Twelve. You don't find a trap on the door. Okay. Well, I don't, it doesn't look like it's trapped, but it's probably going to be locked unless we put this stuff in the Should right order. repeat what the discs are again one more time? It's, the three discs... A... Oh, go ahead. Are a happy-looking female child, a grandiose city, and a brooding devil. <sighs> Two of those things sound very chelly axiom. Does anything about Same. those emblems ring any bells for I don't know, I actually was... Or... Uh, I wanted to look for knowledge of some sort if Rory will allow it. Is there um, a, a knowledge for that, Rory? Um, if this, if this means anything? Really? 
You can roll knowledge. I mean, no, not really. There isn't really a knowledge check associated with this. Oh. The bottom one is so snake tamers. So correct me if I'm wrong. What it looks like is the top one is people in some sort of worship, and the bottom one looks like at least somebody holding whips. Or snakes. I, don't, I can't tell very. Oh. Yes, the top, very the top one has a bunch of faceless worshiping or worshippers, mm -hmm. and the bottom one it shows a bunch of people being condemned. And the middle so one what looks is like middle fire. One? The middle one is blank. So it's I'm guessing kind of artistic depictions is blank otherwise. The problem is is Demon City Chai. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think so too. But who knows what'll happen if we get this wrong? Um, hold on. Let's um. Maybe nothing. Maybe something. Backtrack. Did you guys well, check for magic? Check a little bit. I'm gonna go upstairs. Uh, Roman, do you want to check for magic? I'm gonna go and yeah, see if there's any books magic. or anything like that upstairs. The clues. Is there anything on the the disky things? Uh, first, to ask me Ebo's question. There is a happy-looking female child. <laughs> A grandiose city and, and a, a grinning demon. devil. Okay. Um, sorry, a brooding devil, not a grinning devil. Oh, a oops, devil. Um, Lee, you can roll a search check for searching your own. Rommel, you detect magic. On um, the door or the discs or both? On um, the door. I got a okay. fifteen. On search. I'm looking you, for. You do not find any relevant books. Mm. And the guys have nothing in the, like their pockets or anything like that that would indicate. Nope. Uh, what was the chat? Uh, the. What about the coinage on the table? Standard. What was the child? I'll put it in my pocket. Sure. I assumed you guys took the coinage already. I actually. Okay. Um. Yeah, I'll go Naturally. Back it was like a. It was a grinning female child. Okay. Happy female child, or something like that. Mhm. Mm yeah. Happy female child. <coughs> uh, I'll climb back down, and say, "Um, well, I didn't find anything upstairs." Well, I believe I... that the devil, um, the devil city child is as good as I've got. Uh, this was the a normal manager. It is. Yes. If this was a normal human mosaic, it'd be in the other order. If there's anything that I know about Chaliax, yeah, it's gonna go Demon City Child. Oh, it could be Demon Child City. But let's try Demon City Child. The middle one looks like it's on fire. The middle one is not on fire. It is described as be blank. being blank and just having kind of depictions on it. Okay. Like, um, there's there's no reason for I'm us all to take the heat remember. on this one. If, if you guys want to go back up the ladder, I'll, I'll do it. Are you I sure? will obligingly go up the ladder. <laughs> okay. Mm. So everybody go back up the ladder? Except sure, well, I... Okay. Is that the plan? I'm just asking. That's what I'm doing. Are you sure about this? I, I just said that as a warning, so you guys can do whatever you want. It's let's, brave. Let's, let's just make this clear. If you are staying in the room, stay in the room. If you're not, Okay. In the room. All right, I'll okay. climb out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna like. Are you sure you don't want me to do it? <coughs> no, you guys brought me along for this job. So. All right. Um, one of many jobs. What one are you putting in the top? Godspeed, I'm gonna, sir. I'm gonna put the uh, devil on the top. Okay. So you're, uh, the, I'm sorry. Go ahead. You're putting the devil on the top. Yes. Did anything okay. happen when I did that? Nope. I'm gonna put the city in the middle. Perfect. Okay. Alphabetical order. <laughs> and then I'm go and nothing happened when I did that. Nope. And I'm going to put the baby or the happy child in the bottom. So you're putting the devil with the uh, worshippers at the top, right? The city in the middle, and the child in with the um, the uh, the torturers or the whatever. torturing devils on the bottom. And then I'm gonna brace myself. Yes. When you put the last disc in, the door crackles with electricity, and you can make a reflex save. Okay, I'm gonna make oh. a reflex save. Uh, You're gonna see. make it. Uh, I mean, it's I have a, I have a bonus. I believe in you. Oops. Don't you get a bonus against traps too? Oh, never mind. That was a D2. No, I did a I did a one D. Uh, that was a D2. You yeah, also get a bonus <laughs> against traps, man. Uh, let me check. Or did Actually, you go up trap just... finding? If you have no, dangerous I, sense. Dangerous it's... sense. Yeah, I have danger okay. sense. Unchained rogue gets dangerous. twenty-four. Twenty-four. You can. You have evasion. Yeah, I have evasion. Okay, then you dodge out of the way. Yes. 
Uh, did they pop out, or are they still in? in <laughs> They're still there. Uh, sure. I won't tell anybody. And, oh no, uh, that was a crack of lightning that everybody saw. That would have hit multiple targets. Um. Okay. Yeah, we're good. We're good. <laughs> are, are, nope, are you alright? I'm gonna. It smells uh, singed I, nose hair. Can I pop one out? Sure. Yeah, they come, they they followed easily when you. Okay. Anybody got any other suggestions? <laughs> try I arranging them the other way. Is you could try putting the city on the bottom. Character, or deity, or devil, or historical figure that is portrayed in Keliak symbols uh, with a female child. You could make a knowledge history or religion check. I would love to make a knowledge history check. Not me. I thought we could not make any knowledge checks on these. 15? You are fairly confident that that is not the correct angle. That there's not a specific Chalaxian piece of history that would be applicable. Okay. Yeah, I guess I'd say reverse the bottom ones, unless, of course, the whole thing is a mislead meant to trick overconfident pathfinders <laughs> into thinking that they know Chiliax. Uh But yeah, I'd say reverse the bottom two. That's my best hunch. Wait, so leave the devil on top with the worshippers? Yes. It, I mean, it does seem right, doesn't it? With Isn't the grinning thing? child being whipped on the bottom? Sure. In the middle. The grinning child in the middle. And the okay, city on the bottom. I'm going to put before. the... I'm going to do that. I'll put the grinning child in the middle and the city on the bottom. Okay. Um, when you put those in, you see a little bit of a spark happen, but it looks like that trap has been expended. Yep, that did it. That did it. Uh, the, nothing opened. It, it didn't work, but oh. the trap did not Oh, okay. Sorry, I thought that's what you were telling me. <laughs> yeah, no. The trap would have gone off if it had a reset. Oh, uh, then I'm going to do the way that I wanted, which is put the the devil in the bottom, the city in the middle, and the child on top. Yeah, the door opens. Okay. Do I see anything before I tell anybody? So, you said, sorry, you said, uh, just make your devil on bottom? Yeah. What, what the middle and top? Uh, baby on top, uh, city in the middle? Yep, the door opens. Okay. Uh, do I see anything through the doorway? Yeah, you see a very narrow uh, spiral staircase leading down. Why does everything have to be narrow? Okay, yeah, I'll call them down. Yeah. More lightning bolt traps, that's why. <laughs> yeah, I'll do go you require any healing? Uh, sure, I, I'm good. I'm Doesn't going... it all smell like... Is that a sure or no? Here. I'm good. Okay. So are you guys going to descend the stairway? Is Behind it Helen, there? yes. It is not that dark. I mean, is there light down there? A little. I'll pull up the rear. I would like to... It's hard to see light because it is a very narrow, winding stairway. I will take some time to light my lantern before we start going down. Okay. I will take some my lanta before I... I'm going to go ahead and go down the... Um... Sure. Spiral staircase. Um, you can place yourself at the bottom of the spiral staircase. If you see what I mean, this is a very narrow spiral staircase. Yes. Yeah. Um, sure. Um, so you cannot I pass light people. on. Um... Oh, here's the important thing: you cannot pass people as you go down the staircase. It is too narrow to squeeze through each other's squares. I'm going dead so you last. Decide your order, and place yourself leading back the order. If Oleg now is the first one down. The yep. next person has to be on the steps and then place yourself in the line. I down. am both going first uh, and trying can to I uh, uh, keep, yeah. keep an eye out for when the room shows up. Okay. Yep. Get in the so back can, of the line. Uh, this room has very uh, dimly lit torches. It looks like they've mostly burned out. Um, there's a raised portion in the middle, like a walkway, mm -hmm. that, with ladders leading down to what looks like a storage area. There is a portcullis blocking off steps that lead further down on the other side. Sure. Um, I am going and to... It's 15... It's 15 uh, it's on 15 the sides, it's 15 down. feet down. Yeah, it's 15 feet yeah. down in the, sun, the, the, the sunken sides. I'm going to take a couple um, steps in, and, and may I have a perception check to see if there's anything abnormal about the sides of the rooms? Like sure. the, the can, lower ends? You can make a perception check. Do I need to do two, one for top and bottom? You can just make a perception check. Okay, 16. 
You don't see anything on the floor there. Yeah. Okay. Uh, sure. I'm oh. going to just kind of creep along then, because I don't see anything. But, uh, creep. 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 So I'm, I gave there space. There are two pillows <laughs> on the top left corner that are having uh, sex. So with 16 as you get toward the, uh, towards the middle, you do see a, a, some levers on the ground floor. Oh, okay. Are they the, are they uh, these things like, that I'm oops. that I'm next to? Like, oh my no, god, we've fallen off. Ah. There. there. Mostly just Helen. Th like this mm. one and this one? Yes, and there's another one you can see. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Uh sure, I'll uh, I'll point them out. Um I'll also if I don't see anything dangerous, I'm going otherwise I'm going to head over to the portcullis and sure. take a the look at that. Portcullis that didn't work because I am snapped to grid. Helen is going to... You can make um, the line really thick. Be very cautious, and I'm going to try to like, uh, um, look at stuff that's around there. Oh, the portcullis yeah. is blocking up. Can I keep an eye out too? Yeah, you guys can make perception checks. Perception. Yeah. 20. God damn, Daver. Perception check, but... Must yeah, observe it being Perception line. too. Five. Okay. Mm -hmm. 25. 26. Wow. With all the 20s. Way to blow all your high rolls, guys. <laughs> <laughs> it's important to see sometimes. Hey, I can't hit for shit, so might as well use them for something. Uh, so rolls can't by what, what did people get? 26. <laughs> Lee, what okay. did you hey, get? I don't see anything out of order. I got a 5. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Ebo, for bringing attention to my failure. Uh, the 26 and 27, was it? 26 25. And 25. Um, 25 and 26. You, and a 5. You see that the, that pile of rugs in the upper left corner, the uh, northwest corner, have something underneath it, but it doesn't look like it's moving or anything. Helen? Do you want to lead on that? Yeah, I'll, cover I'll you. follow right behind, but you're How going to lead. How far down is it? 15 feet down. There's those ladders uh, right there, though, yeah? Yeah. She'll jump down the panel. I'll bring down feet. the rear. Sure. Rory, I'm going to check the uh, portcullis for traps. Sure. You can roll that. If I... If the I'll water detect comes magic. out of here... I was about to do... Standing around. I'll detect magic and look at the other side. 23. Um... 23, you detect no tra traps. Um, Rommel, you detect magic. Where at? You do not determine a location. Can I concentrate to determine a location, or will I not get one? Uh, you can make a spellcraft check. I think we're going to be swimming with the fishies. Yeah, 14. You can't determine where it is. Is that unusual? You can make a knowledge or counter check. I'm gonna wander here and does that kind of indicate magic that the magic aura is covering an area that I'm in, or make a knowledge or counter check? Okay. <laughs> um, Twenty-four. You know that some specific schools of magic are more difficult to detect, and you may detect the presence of magic but not determine anything else about them at times. There's one school in specific that tends to act this way. Which Rory, one? can I cast um illusion? Okay. Rory, I'm gonna cast detect magic. Can I uh, look around? Yeah, you detect magic. Can I go through the same basically can, the same motions that Ronald did? You can make a spellcraft check. There we go. Awesome. I got the same roll. God damn it. Yep. <laughs> I'm gonna say quietly something's off. With that uh, fairly high check on Knowledge Economy, you would know that not all illusion spells work this way. Specifically spells that mask appearance or make things hard to see cannot hide locations as well, often. <laughs> things like misdirect, non-detection, invisibility, think, uh, in that category. I'm going to draw my uh, mace. Sure. I'm Helen, what are you things. doing? I mean, you can move the blankets and you find another lever. Oh, there's a lever over here. Here we go. 
Hmm. Hey, Olek not. Uh, Rory, yes, do any of the, um... Check out this lever over here. There's a lot of, like, barrels and stuff in this place that I can, like, on the map. Um, does any of this stuff look valuable? Um, yeah. You can search around. Yeah. Want me to roll perception again? Yeah. You're gonna be pathetic. You're gonna, you have to move down to the middle, so it's a really short oh, Yeah. I'm gonna move down here. I got a nine. Okay. Uh, most of it looks like it's really old. It looks like a lot of it was, uh, food stuffs and perishable supplies. There's a lot of places where you found like empty containers. You think that when the Declans left, this is the stuff they left behind. Hmm. I'm gonna check out the lever. Sure. Is it it's a, a large floor level, the kind that you would grab and like pull it to the side? Yeah, I wonder if we have to do them in a specific order or all at the same time. You say that lever. You should check. You should check out at least one of them to see if they're trapped. Uh, sure. I'm gonna check out the one he's at. I'm okay with this. 27. <laughs> yeah, you don't see any traps. Nice. All right. <coughs> Richard's on a roll with his Richard, 20s. Richard, don't, don't waste those on skill checks. Um, okay. These are good uh, skill checks. Rory. Sure. Um, do I see anything along the walls or anything that might be a clue as to... Um, what, how to use the switches other than just pulling them at random? It looks like the switches would need to be pulled. You don't see any... You can make a perception check, I guess. Sure. 13. You don't see anything that really tells you, like, an order or gives hints of that nature? Uh, well, if there's no order, then all at once seems like the most obvious way, right? Uh, yeah, I guess. I don't, I don't see why not. Uh, <laughs> There's something magical in here, but I can't tell what it is or where it is, for that matter. So, yeah, um, the same. if there's a trap, we may as well spring it. I can attempt to see if I can figure it out. <laughs> One extra uh, person, uh, yeah, I suppose. Wait. I'll, wait. I'll wait to see if Shinsaku does something. Yeah, cool Rory, same system as everybody else did. Detect magic. <laughs> yes. Can we just talk off, Jack? Yeah. Okay. These rolls be on my side. Watch it be a 14. <laughs> I will should have break if that's the case. <laughs> oh my god. I get you you can't tell anything extra. If you think we're gonna be ambushed, right, well, uh... maybe we should use the buddy system when we're pulling these things. We don't have that many buddies. Fair mm -hmm. enough. Sure, I'm gonna make my way over to this one. I mean there's right, six there. of us. I'll go with a look at And there's four levers. I think I see what he's saying. Put three mm. people on top, three people on the bottom. Mm-hmm. Um, did I did I see anything in the junk if I was to look for valuables? You could take some time to look. Sure, uh, I'm gonna do that. Rommel, I guess you and I are on the fourth. I guess. Uh, 23. Yeah, you think it's all pretty much worthless. Um, at one time it probably had value, but most of it is perishable or broken or damaged or sure. not really useful anymore. Rory, is, is this the sort of thing that I use disable device to use the switch on for the portcullis, or is this the sort of thing that I just pull a switch? You think you just pull a switch? Where I'm going to change right, uh, to my position. Try... Count of three? Sure. One, <laughs> two, three! Yeah, so the, switch, the switches all move surprisingly easily. They're very oh. smooth to pull. When you pull all four of them over, the portcullis rises up with a clang Hound. clanging clatter. Hound's going to run up the, the ladder. Yeah, yeah Bob. Uh, Olek Nod's um, going to do the same thing. So... Why? Just one second. I'm leaving yeah. post haste immediately. I do not like the idea of a 15-foot um, pit with me in it. So remember that up the ladder is 30 feet of movement right. if you're doing a fast climb. Mm. That's fine. Which will require a climb check. So don't, so don't just move yourself across. I'll make a climb uh, check. Uh, Jeff, for example. What? Yeah. <laughs> nice. What? Since Is the it 10 ladder... enough for fast climb? Jeff, you were, you were back. Put, move yourself back to the bottom of the ladder if you're waiting to see if, if Lee's climbing up first. What ladder are you talking about? The one that's oh. right directly under me. 
I rolled oh. a 22 for my fast climb check. Okay, so you get to the top. And that would be... Um, Is from it where 10 enough for a fast climb? That would be uh, 40 feet of movement for you, all if not. Because... Oh, okay. I am at the top then because I have only 30 feet. Oh, right. unless I can do a second <laughs> move. Um, if you're talking in initiative. Basically, I'm not, I don't want to drop into initiative quite yet. Um, <laughs> but uh, basically, everybody's getting one action. Does point. a 10 make the oh, fast sure. climb? Being yeah, that's as right. high up and on the ladder as I can possibly get is good so enough. That, again, that's 40 feet of movement yep. for you. I would be um, right. I would you, be here at the top of the ladder. You can't fail. Helen, on crit, on yeah. you, you, right. you, you cannot fail this climb check. That is true. Um, yes. Gavrin, you are on the ladder, that means? Underneath. Is Shinsaku moving toward the ladder or wait? I will let you go first, Rommel. Okay. I bet there's danger up there, but I'll go. <laughs> Unless you don't want to, that's fine. I like how pessimistic Rommel is a lot of it so often. I'm just saying, like, Thanks if I stay going. at the bottom, the danger will be at the bottom. If I rush to the top, the danger will probably be up there. Mm -hmm. Well, it this sounds like being on the ladder is the best place. Yeah, I know, except that the danger is probably going to come off the side of the wall ladder? at the ladder height. I can't use acrobatics, can I? We're going to be all shooting all no. the time. Boom! I'm... Yeah, okay, I so barely... uh, I believe we are in our one action positions right now. So Shintaku's not going <laughs> up the ladder at all. She's staying on the ground. I'm just confirming that. He wants to go up the ladder, but and I did not on the ladder. For climbing. I'm sorry, I have to roll? Yeah, you, you, want want to do you want to do an accelerated climb. That's fine. If you uh, want to do a normal climb, you will be halfway up the ladder. Oh, Shinsaku could if I aid him. Fail the check, right. will, I, will I not climb the ladder? Correct. Can I aid him from the bottom? Not really. Okay. Okay. I'm just going to climb halfway then. Okay. Push so Shinsaku's on the ground. Rommel is halfway up. Davrin is, is, is halfway up. Davrin is halfway up, and the other two people are at the uh, other two people are at the tops of the ladder, and Helen is all the way at the top. At this point, the uh, uh, northeast and southwest levers click back to their original position. <sighs> what are you guys going to do? Uh, the the portcullis is still open. Yep. Uh, I'm going to. I'm going to go inside. Okay. Uh... <laughs> I'll, I'm going to make space for anybody else that's trying to run in. Hmm. Well, I can you, make it in there. Do you understand what I mean, Rory? Because I had a couple more squares of movement, but I'm basically in the stairway, right? Yeah, you can be like one square down. It is very narrow. Anybody else would be moving at half speed other than you. Anybody else is squeezed, you're small, so you're not actually squeezed in the stairway. Right. Squeeze. Is Helen, that's as far as you move? Yep. Okay. Oh, is, I'll is shout. Maybe we moving? can break can it. I, can I help Rommel up? I mean, I'll try to climb the rest of the way up. If I, can. I mean, no, if you're moving, you can't help him up. Yeah, you can get to the, to the top. It's you, only, you can it's only, it's only he only moved movement. once. Yeah. Yeah, I'm basically doing this in, like, single actions. Um, nobody's done more than yeah. a single, like, move with each of these, like, turns. I'm not doing these in full turns. I'm just kind of keeping track of each thing. I don't know what um, you can get at the top, Rommel. Uh, uh, is Shinsaku starting to climb or staying down? I would like to start to climb. Are you doing fast climb or just safe climb? Safe climb. Okay. Um, what about Tayang? I'm going to move. Here. Okay. I got a 13 and to follow. Sure. You're... Uh. How high you did have, you say um, these are? You have 20 feet of movement left, Jeff, if you have 30 feet of movement. I don't. Permanently. Then you have 10 feet of movement. Uh, okay. Okay. Um, okay. What are people doing next? I'll say, hold it open. I'm going to look at Helen and say, can do. Oh, no. I'm going to give more space for people to climb in. 25. I'm going to move to here. Okay. And I'm going to 
try to... Is, are, are these stairs going up or down? Down. Down? Yeah, I guess I'm going to get on this side of it, and I'm going to try to brace it. Okay. With my muscle. Is that what Helen is doing also? Trying to brace it? Yeah, do I have to get closer to it? Yep, you'd have to be in the square it's in. Can I take a five-foot step and brace it? Yes. Um, Rommel, are you moving? Uh... Jeez, uh, I'm going to go up by it, but I'm not going to go in yet. Okay. I'm just going to try to observe what is happening with the levers from here. Should we at least keep four out just in case something That's, happens? That was my thinking. Yeah. Yeah. The portcullis closes without all of us. Also, if the portcullis closes with all of us. We're going to be in okay. a bit of a vibe. No. Shintaku, you're moving? No, I'm moving back up. I'm sorry. I'm hearing everybody talking, and I'm making sure they got their step done. Okay. The uh, other two level levers switch back to the, your original position, and the portcullis is dropping. Um, one of you can roll to assist, and one of you can roll a strength check. I will roll to assist. I got a 22 to assist. God damn okay. it. You can assist well, Helen. I... Helen, you get a plus two. Don't worry. You better roll another 19. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what, did, what class are you in? I'm a Magus. Holy I have 16 crap. strength and 16 intelligence, boy. You are as strong as me. <laughs> <laughs> All Helen? right. Nice. <laughs> okay, nice. Nice. You, you are holding the portcullis up. This is not something that you will be able to maintain very well. You will be making difficult strength checks every turn. You were aware that, um, the, that the DC was around 20. Did oh. Everett move last turn? He did. Because I don't he think he not. moved on the turn that I moved oh. to hold the door. Well, look he not, moved, you up, jam he moved up on the, um, on the last turn. On the turn before that, that is. Okay. At this point, everybody should roll initiative. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, brother. Uh, did I miss a movement, Rory? Or no? You did. I, I, I don't know. I, I, think you did. I mean, no, we, I've, moved, we did, each moved twice. Did you get to where you are, Lee, the moment? Like, where did you get after you first climbed the ladder? Because I was following inside. you. Yeah, I think we you have twice after the ladder. Okay. I think you have 20. Yeah, we moved twice. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, okay. All right. Oh, God. Okay. See, I don't have a lot yeah. of dexterity, 13 again. nor do I have a lot of charisma. The same. I do, and that's pretty low. My, um, my stats are 16, 12, 14, 16, 10, 8. Aeyong looks like he might have been handsome at one point, but his bald head is all scarred up. <laughs> looks like from fire. Okay, Chaos. so the port call, call is held open at this point. You cannot move and keep the portcullis held open. Um, Helen, just so you know, people will have to squeeze past you. Uh, it is a very narrow stairway, so they will need an acrobatics check if they want to squeeze past you. I'll say, oh, no, we need, we need, we need your uh -oh. hands on this. Uh, okay, Rory, so you'll need I... a strength check every turn and an acrobatics check to, for anybody to squeeze past you. Um, Rory, um, is there any, I'm sorry, am I not allowed to do anything until initiative? We are in initiative. And, uh, okay, it hasn't started yet, as far as I, I, I know. Okay, then we're good. So we'll wait till you're ready. Yep, Shinsaku, what are you doing? I'm going to acrobatics in. Okay. Uh... You currently can't because um, no. Taeyang is in the way. You cannot fit in that square because he's already squeezing. Oh, okay. okay. Well, then I rolled for nothing. I thought Taeyang was, was on hoping. the other side. I'm on. Well, Taeyang is in the stairwell. I'm in the stairwell holding the door and open. You cannot pass a medium creature in the stairway. Okay. There's well, then I guess I'm behind Helen and I will help Helen in the meantime. You can't assist Helen because you can't reach the portcullis. Okay, then I'm waiting to get in. Do you want? Are you delaying? Sure. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so we'll put you at delaying instead. Oh, like not? Um, because of my size, am I allowed to squeeze by? Yes, you will have to make an acrobatics check to get by a medium creature, but you can attempt. 
Um, the only th would I be able to? I'm sorry. If, if I um, am in the stairwell and I get to where Taeyang is, can I? I just need to know if I see a way to. Um, you cannot end your turn in the Taeyang Square. I'm not in Taeyang Square. I'm saying like when I get to him, am I able to see if there's a way to uh, wedge the door? Uh, Richard, you cannot split on action. You can't end your movement in Taeyang Square, so okay, you can't well, stop okay. and make a perception check and continue Since your You movement. can wait you until my here. turn and I can move. Can I'm I not no. see the door? Taeyang is in the stairway. You just moved Taeyang into a different square than he is in. Well, no, but I thought you were saying he was in the square, and I thought no, we just... I, right no, they couldn't move. she couldn't move into the stairway because I'm a medium-sized creature in a stairway, and she's also medium. Yes. That's why she couldn't tumble, like, even if her tumble check like, was she successful. She can tumble past Helen, but then she can't go anywhere. Okay. You can't get into this. I thought that the way. Sorry, I just heard you wrong. I'm sorry. That's I did, fine. I was under the impression he wasn't in the stairway at all because he was assisting. At He's the door. assisting Helen from the stairway side. Okay. There's nothing I can do. I am going to go further up. And Down the stairs. I, yeah. Sorry. I'm gonna go further ahead and I'm gonna, I'm gonna head that way in stealth, to okay. um, see what's ahead. Sure. The stairways head down about. Uh, 30 feet to another level. Um, okay. I would not be able to do all of that movement. Uh, well, actually, maybe because I was already uh, some of the way in. So, sure. Um, may I stealth the, the rest of the way? Sure. Um, you you can get down there and look, and you can see a narrow kind of hallway that is poorly lit. But there's some. You can make a perception check. Okay, I'm going to do that. 27. Jesus. Um, a long hallway. What's the range of your That's 60 feet? feet? A long hallway that goes about as far as your dark vision. Um, it looks like it leads to another uh, staircase at the other end. You see uh, deep niches every five feet along the entire hallway. Uh, Are they like chest height or like, well, I they're guess. Like, they're like chest height to above your head. Okay. For you, chest tight on you to above your head. Um, gotcha. Uh, you see a number of skeletal remains littering the floor. Are uh, they about where the niches are? And a couple of recently dead bloody corpses. Are any of those things closer to me than a niche? Uh, there's niches every five feet the entire hallway. I know, but are any of the corpses closer to me than those? Like, is, he one, is there one within five feet? No, okay. there's not okay. one in the first five foot square. Okay. Um, that I think that's the, that's all I can do, right? Yep. Okay, I'm gonna stop my turn. Okay. Um, Davrin, what is your flat footed AC? I assume that's the same as my regular AC. I don't know if you have yes. a dexterity modifier. Not a chance. <laughs> a creature is a creature is jumping out of invisibility to attack you. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go pee. Jokes on him. Uh, you see a small flying humanoid with bat-like wings and a stinger tail. And he will try to sting you. God damn it. <coughs> Fifteen. Does not hit. Okay. Um, a second small... That like humanoid with a stinger tail is going to pop out of the visibility, flying at the same height as the as you there, and he will. Um, you speak common, right? I do. Yep. He will tell you to bring him a thumbtack, and okay. you can make a will save. Mm hmm. I will do my best. It's a good thing he's a raging barbarian. Sixteen. Sixteen is enough. You don't have to bring him a thumbtack should you not want to. Well, I don't have one anyway. You may still if you would like to. And then it is Daverin's turn. Uh, can I attack the imp next to me? It is. Possible. Uh, I'm attacking it. Yeah. Refresh okay. real quick. Sorry. Um, ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. No bard stuff. This up. Um, 
I don't know, does 21 hit? It does. 19 damage. What type of weapon are you using? No dachi. Nothing special about it? Nope, that is true. Okay. It does not seem to do full damage, and the imp is still alive. Is this a full turn? <clears throat> Sorry, what? Uh, never mind. I'm actually going to stay here. I'm good. Okay. Helen? Do I have to... You can choose to drop the portcullis, or you can make a strength <coughs> check and hold it up as a full round action. Can always hit it again. You said that two of the levers flipped the other way. All four of the level levers have flipped the other way at this point. But was it two and then two? It was. Hmm. Probably okay. not a coincidence. I am going to uh, drop. You also the... can see two flying little humanoids in the room. I'm gonna drop the portcullis. Okay. And I am going to rage. Okay. And I'm gonna charge. Through Shinsaku. Sure. You can shove her aside. You can shove her aside. I will. <laughs> and she won't go. go she won't, no, she, you don't actually leave her square. Aww. And I am not going to power attack. Could have been a little okay. dramatic. I think shove aside should treat the person like a grenade like missile to see where they end up from the shove. Oh, that would be so fun. <laughs> And there okay. it is. Rommel? Um. <coughs> is the one to the south down on the ground or up in the air? He's 20 feet up from the ground, so he's on level with you. Um. Yeah, I guess, uh, sort of shot, I'll try to color spray him. <laughs> sure. Nice. Uh, you could also make a knowledge planes if you'd like to know more about it. Nope. Got it. Okay. Um, Wait, am I locked on the other side of this thing? You are. Neat. Uh, he has a 21. Yeah, he makes it. Right, anything else? Nope. Tayon? I probably should have held. Uh, I don't know if that would have gonna... worked or better. I'm going to say... <laughs> oh, what the hell? Um, <laughs> and then... <laughs> uh, geez. Um, <laughs> I'm going to try to... This is a terrible idea. I'm going to try to throw a bottle of holy water at one of them. Sure, that's like got a range increment of 10 feet, so you'll be in the third range yeah. increment. So that will be a, a minus, minus four, six. minus, minus four. four, and you're throwing into melee through cover. So that's another minus four and minus four, so you're getting a minus 12. Yeah, oh boy. I'm pretty sure that would put me somewhere in the minus 11 total range. So I'm going to cheese it. And... Uh... You know, I'm going to try to lift the portcullis. Sure. Bam. Got a four. Make a I throw my back out. <laughs> 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 you like hear this horrible Sorry. snap. And Zaku, like, oh. are you continuing, continuing to hold past the turn? No, I am not. Would you like to act? Yes. Okay. Uh, what is it? Your turn. Fire courage is now up at this point. Oliknot? I'm going to put him at holding. Um, he's going to take a five foot fly away and he is going to <laughs> suggest to Helen to bring him a cork board. All right. <clears throat> Helen can make a little save. I'm doing that. <laughs> Fifteen. Oh, I think it's a really yes. good idea to bring him a cork board for like half a second, and then you're like, wait, 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 probably shouldn't do that in the fight, and you don't have to bring him a cork board. Oh, oh good. 
this one is going to fly over to Rommel and attempt to sting Rommel. Um, yep, that's fair enough. Uh, that is going to be a 12 to hit Rommel. Can you remember to make That's a really good attack roll for a 4. He does it with them. Yep, you remembered your mage armor this time. Davard? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna move. <laughs> Fuck it, I'm gonna move here. Five foot step. Okay. Attack. Fuck it. Does 20 hit? It does. 13 damage? It dies. Nice. Nice. Done. Helen? <laughs> I'm gonna take a five foot step. How far away is this thing? It's at level. Okay, I'm My gonna take five foot step and power attack it because I missed before. Sure, that makes sense. Eighteen. That will hit. Okay. Do we have Bartong? Yes, we do. Alright. None of that Final Fantasy eleven. <laughs> Those are the only Bart songs I know. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. I remember having that ugly damn monster signal. Uh, Helen, is that a special yep. anyway, or is it just an ordinary? It's a sword? normal great sword. Okay, it is not dead. It's not a normal sword. Is one of them great. dead, or did it disappear? One of them is dead. Rommel? Um. Yeah, Rommel's gonna take a five foot step back. Yeah, I guess I'm gonna try to shoot a ray of frost at the little guy. Or did we determine they're immune to ice? Your knowledge check told you immune to fire and poison, resistant to acid and cold. Okay, I won't bother with that then. Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess. Uh, hmm. Give it just one sec. Uh, I guess I'll cast resistance on myself. And that's it. Uh, you guessed it. I'm trying to lift it. I rolled a 20. You guessed <laughs> it. <laughs> Frank is alone. That is what you needed to lift it. Alright. I'm going to move through. Uh, uh, you, uh, that's a four-round action. You can take a five-foot step. <laughs> I can take Which a five foot step. Which I don't believe you can make anywhere at this point. Nope. So I will, Taeyang will flex and lift it after throwing his back out, and then he will hold it and say... Clinch your cheeks! <laughs> and say, Rommel, you gotta move out of the way. <laughs> Shinsaku? Oh, look not, you are currently holding it. Oh, sure. I, um, did I just, um, nope, I'm still in that other realm, aren't I? Yep. What, what what did I hear? Because I mean, as far as I know, nothing has happened. Until you hear combat? I, uh, I heard the portcullis shut. You heard combat. Oh, okay. I think you heard um, the portcullis slam shut and then creak open again. Well, I was gonna say. Oh, okay. Um, then I am going to head back. Okay. I I think that my amount of movement uh, for the thirty foot. Would you said it was a thirty foot staircase? Yep. Um, then I would basically only get to where Taeyang is. Sure. Uh, and a regular move. Taeyang you is see me hoisting the door. This, holding the, stair the portcullis open. <laughs> uh, sure, I'll tickle him. No. Um, <laughs> when I get to the... Uh, I can't see the room from a step behind him, can I? Correct. So you're actually below him. Uh... But I, I can I can squeeze by, you said. You can make an acrobatics check to try to squeeze by. I'm gonna try to do that. Okay, you can squeeze by. Counted as two squares of terrain. Okay. And then, do I have to keep doing it for each person? No. Okay. So that would be forty feet of movement to get there. That's fine. That's fine. I'm doing a double move at this point. Okay. Shinsaku. 
Uh, Lingering's active on a five foot step this way. I would like to assist Helen. Or aid, I guess okay. it is. Can this you describe guy... what I'm seeing in the room? Imps. Just the flying. How many evil bastards? Davern? Did it just disappear? It yeah, did. it did. <laughs> Apparently, it wanted nothing to do with us. Hmm. All right, I'm gonna move there and ready to attack an imp. Okay, I'm gonna move you to holding then. Helen, okay. <clears throat> can I make a perception check to find the imp? You and me. Thirteen. You do not see the imp. I'm gonna. Are all the. Yeah. Are all the levers pulled? Yes. Okay. I am going to. Um... I'm gonna hold. Okay. Rommel? <clears throat> all right. Um, I'm gonna move out of the way. Thank goodness. Uh, and who grant Helen the touch of destiny? And I'm done. Tiang is going to move to this side. Okay. And continue to try to hold the door. Sure. I got a ten. He lets the door slam. Yeah. Clang your shot. Oliknot. Uh, Oliknot is going to hold until. He sees something. Okay. Shinsaku? Lingering is still active, but I will hold. Okay. <laughs> Rommel? All right. If it's holding. <laughs> um. Let's see. We still don't see this thing, right? Nobody does. No one sees it. Yeah, um... Just we keep trying to find it. Blow spells on this encounter. But... I'm going to blast a color spray and a, a cone basically starting in the square below Helen and going diagonally to the down to the uh, right. Sure. Basically covering the last known space that the imp inhabited. Okay. If it's in there, it needs to make a will save DC sure. uh, 15. Okay. People can make a perception check. 26. I got a Five. 6. Well, Thanks, not Sure. Dumb. Damn it. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> so dumb. Do you know where? No. I mean, you're not able to determine the location, but you hear a thump of something falling. I think you got him, Rommel. Get it. Go down there and squash it. Hey, Ed, you can uh, roll for a um, three hit die creature. Roll what now? Oh. Uh. Shucks, I forget what he has. Uh, it is three. That will grant me one d four. It's uh, four rounds of blind and stun, and then one round of stun. Yep. So five rounds of it being stunned. Go down there and squick it. Taeyang, what are you doing? Wait, can I um, can I start my turn? Sure, you can start your turn. Oliknad, what are you doing? I am going to hop down. Uh, Acrobatics? Yeah, sure. I mean, does this box count as uh, anything? You're still dropping down 10 feet. So That's fine. I'm going to roll yeah. acrobatics, but I'm trying to not do the full distance. Yeah. You're fine? 
And I'm going to guess that it wasn't in this spot, so I'm going to hop down again. Do I have to do an acrobatics from the 10-foot nope. one? And no, you, then... you, you just fell 10 feet. That was only 5 feet. So okay, like I'm it. just making sure. Um, okay, and how much of my movement did I use? 10 feet. All right, I'm going to move to this spot. Sure. And then I'm going to move to this spot. Sure. And then I'm going to move to this spot. Sure. <laughs> Let's see, that is 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, and I'll move to this spot. Sure. And then, and nothing? Nothing. Okay, I... Um, if you are trying to find an invisible creature, you should still be making perception checks. Oh, I thought that I run into them if I go into the square. Nope. If it's stunned, you probably just walk over it like it's not even there. It is also size category tiny. <laughs> size of a cat. Oh, I'm sorry. Wow. I thought... I figured it was like a medium uh, or something. I think I'm done. I used my whole deal trying to okay. move around. Uh, I'll do... I can do a action still. Did you, did you move 30 feet? I only moved 30. So you could do an active search if you'd wanted to. Uh, yeah, let me do that. Thank you for telling me because I have no idea how to do I, the things I was that trying Olaf to figure out what you were doing, and I'm like, uh... Well, because oh, the only sure. encounter that I've ever had with invisible creatures in Pathfinder in my whole life was the last thing yeah, that we did, in which I ran into a spot that had an invisible creature, and then something happened. Yeah, that was a big burly guy. This is a like little cat-sized flying bat creature. Okay, that was not told to me uh, when I entered the room. Although Sorry, it was I said imp, and I thought you knew what that was. I, I don't, other than uh, mythology. Yeah. 23 for the search. Okay. Um, you were aware Sorry, Ed, that you had to sigh like that. You were aware that what an imp is in Pathfinder. That that a invisible creature automatically gets a plus twenty on its stealth check. Okay. And that an immobile invis uh, invisible creature gets a plus forty on its stealth check. Oh, well, then why did I bother? What you do is you start you, you take a sewer like a a sewer lid, and you just start dropping it in every square until it hits something. That said, I probably would have been better off attacking at a square. It's not actively trying to hide. Um, I think... Okay, I know what... You do not find it, but it is possible for you to find it, is what I will tell you from that one. Well. Okay. Um, sure. Tayan? Oh, man. I'm going to go after Taeyang. Because I forget. Lee? Hmm? Is Taeyang doing anything? It's your oh, turn. jeez, I'm sorry. He's eating um, Pringles or something. I'm eating Pringles. Um, five, ten, thirty. Yeah, I'm gonna pull this lever. Okay. Is anybody else not? Is anybody still holding? I'll just roll a perception. I guess that's all we can do oh, right now. Yeah. No, Rory. I'm gonna try and open the door no, if I can I'm take kidding. my turn. You can try to open the door. All right. Dolls my line. 18. Nope. Okay. Uh, Shinsaku is going Damn. after that. Everyone's real fucking strong. Damn. Um. Helen's moving. I'm moving. Shinsaku, what are you doing? Uh, I'd like to roll a perception, I guess, to find him. Are you moving down to search the area? Oh, is he down in the area? You heard we don't know. You know that Olegnat jumped down and is searching down there. I think Olegnat said something, but I'm not sure. I didn't find anything, so... Did you say he's down here or anything like that? I did when uh, when the thump happened. Okay. I said, so Rommel, I think down. you got him. Yeah. So, Shinsaku? Alright, I guess I'll go down, and going down a ladder is full movement, right? Okay, so that's your turn? Yep. I'm gonna go ahead and put him at the end, since he's not actively uh, holding anyone. moving. Sure, I, mo I saw you move. Rommel? And then she's going, she's gonna go up and go down the other ladder. That's how far? Um, 
it's gonna be I got 40 feet movement so I'm going to so you get down that with one ladder you don't go up one ladder and then down another ladder I was going to um, you were up top over by Rommel yeah actually I think my turn is me going over here and then down the ladder right so that's, that's, my that's, what I was, turn. that's your fruit yeah Rommel um all right um i am going to cast a spell uh i'm going to cast detect poison on a five foot cube uh, atop where the lever is you detect poison i'm gonna yell out that i think he's by the lever <laughs> oh look that oh that's a pretty clever move detecting poison I'm you guessing. can't normally use detection spells on creatures, but that is clever enough that I'm going to let it go. Uh, I'm going it, to it, attack at the lever. Attack. Sorry, you can't normally use detect poison on invisible things. You can't use any detect spells on invisible things. They just don't show up in the area. But that is clever enough, and if the oh. creature is not aware, then that is totally <laughs> awesome, and I'm letting it go for it. Okay, Rory, uh, I've, I've, got a, I've got a couple questions. Uh, in this scenario, or in this particular situation, am I allowed to attack it where something might yes. be... You can attack the square it is in. You now know which square it is in. You will attack it. It has 50% mischance because you still don't know the exact position of it. Okay. Also, um, that, can that I... That said, it is currently helpless. <laughs> so, so it doesn't have a good AC. You get a 50-50 coup de gras. You can't coup de gras because you can't discern this anatomy. Yeah, anatomy. That's also why you can't sneak attack it. But you have a 50-50 shot of hitting it, and it's really low AC. Can you still flank it? You could try to grapple it. It's, well, no, I'm not. I'm not in a position to flank with anybody right now. Um, okay, the, the, the other thing is, that. is that I basically have to pick a square, and if I pick the wrong square, then nothing happens. You know that it is the square directly north of you. It's okay. the lever square they were just like, mentioning. Well, okay. He said by the lever, and that's like nine squares. I am so. on the ground okay, so though. You could make five foot step. More complicated than you need to, Richard, for that. I'm. I will attack at the lever square. Okay. Um, I will use a full attack action so that I can get two swings. Sure. Are we are we singing? Yes. I think we have lingering song. Uh, it's been three rounds, so no. No, then it's not up. Okay. I am going to. Rounds go really fast when there's almost nobody swinging a weapon. Yeah. You could try to grapple it. Taeyang is right. Um. Okay. Um. Uh... A nine will hit with a dagger. Too late because I've already attacked. So sure. I'm just a nine gonna... will hit. Uh, Seventeen will hit. Um, I have to do a fifty percent miss chance on each one. Yep. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna do uh, one is bad. So one hit. Okay. Statistics work, ha. Huh? Uh, yeah, I think that's right. Is this an ordinary weapon? No, this is a, so, oh, you know what, I probably shouldn't have had the plus one in there, because these were uh, imps, so I was using the silver. So, it's one so, damage, actually? One damage. Sure, sure, one damage does actually affect it. Tayan? Um, I'm going to, um... where is Helen going? Why did you come down the same side as me? Uh, for Helen, it's uh, it's the exact same speed. Like I can make it up both sides and down. So yeah, well, but I can only get to one side. You can't uh, go up and down the other. It is a move There's action. There's also other people over there. For what it matters, it is a move action to pull lever. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty. Okay, I'm gonna go. Oh man, this is dumb. Um, <laughs> so you can do it anyway. <laughs> Yes, this room is cleverly designed to be just <laughs> far enough apart to be annoying. I'm going to move right there, and I'm going to say, I got it. That, that's a single, <laughs> isn't that a single 1d3 move? 1d3 for your silver dagger, hunt? That is. I'm sorry, Rick. 1d3, I thought it was a... Davern? Oh, for me, it's one t, I, have I have the power. Oh. And it is a 1d3 minus 1. The right. portcullis from a down position. Ugh. I didn't pull my back out, did I? One. Nope, you're fine. All right. I, I rolled a one on mine. Minus on mine. one for silver? 
Yeah, silver what, weapons if you have a, do minus one. If you have a silver one, slashing or piercing slashing weapon. Yeah. yeah. Because silver is not a general cutting metal. It is not good at being sharp. It's okay for smashing, though. Hmm, yeah. Alright. I took the five foot step, and I'm just gonna swing at it, I guess. You can sure. get flanking. Yeah. So then Are that you... gives me a plus one, right? Plus two. two. So then I just get the plus one out of it. No, 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 no. It's just plus two to hit. Like I flanking it. would. It, silver it's doesn't affect your to to hit. Damage, not minus one to hit. For being silver. If yeah. that's what you're getting the up on. That'll 14. hit. Roll Do you have no base attack bonus for it? I thought silver dagger was taken away. No, I just told you that, and also... Well, I'm getting confused, alright? I know, I'm trying to... So it, it hits, it doesn't matter. Roll your mischance. Alright, same thing, one is bad. Nice. So it hits. This is where the minus one is to it, so damage on silver weapons. That's the yeah. only minus from silver weapons. So it's 1d4 oh, minus one. Minus one. one. Yeah. Two. Two! Okay. Helen? Alan is going to stare daggers, and then, um... <laughs> the thing, and, okay. uh... And then move down the thing? I, and then move down the thing. Can I take sure. a five-foot step up and jump down? Sure. Or a drop down? That's fine. You can make an acrobatics check. Alright, cool. Hey, you can do one of those really cool slide down the ladder tricks, except these are wood, and then you're probably gonna get a bunch of splinters on I'm your hands. Get a one again. Oh, six, fourteen. So you need a fifteen to reduce falling damage. You bet. <laughs> of course. Crack. Okay. You know this problem never used to happen, but that cursor thing where it blips to the wrong part is happening for me tonight. Yeah, it's been doing that for me too a lot. Yeah. Do I'll take two non-lethal damage, Helen? Okay. Do that for easy. Am I, or you, am I you are prone. That's You're 40. prone. I'm just going to pull the lever from the ground. <laughs> yes! That will require a swing check because it's very awkward. I'll just get up then. Okay, so you, you could either pull it from the ground with a swing check or you could stand up as your move action. I'm going to stand up. Okay. Rommel? Uh, I'm going to hold, I guess. Well, like that. Oliknot is going to attack again. Sure. Um, let's see. Thirteenth hit, right? Yep. And then one is bad. One of them hits. Sure. For two damage. Okay. Tayan? I'm going to pull the lever. Okay. I'm gonna go. Ever? Uh, I'm gonna open the door. Okay. I'm on this lab ladder. Okay. Oh, I'll roll my climb. <sighs> uh, same thing again. We're gonna stab that area. Sure. Sorry, hang on a second. That's fine. Helen, you can go while she's figuring her stuff go out. Go ahead. Helen's gonna hit the lever. Okay. And she gonna move. Okay. Sprint, did you attack? There we go. No, that's what I said. Give me a second, because my oh, okay. page just wasted. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just uh, keeping things moving. So while Helen is, I mean, Helen is just moving well. Yep, so that'll hit. Are we just pulling the levers to run through the door again? Uh, I'm not sure what's going on with that. I don't either, because no one's mentioned it. Uh, that, that, so you can roll your high lotion, Saku? Yeah, one is bad. Okay. okay, I missed. Olignut? Um, okay, Olignut's gonna attack again. Sure. And then one is bad. Here you go. Okay. Tayan? Okay. I'm going to... <laughs> I'm gonna move there, and that's it. 
Okay. Tavern? <laughs> Third time's a charm. Damn it. Okay. Same thing. At this point, Eight. I'm stronger than you are. Yeah. Does she need Eight to roll the mystery? Eight does not hit. Eight does not hit. Okay. Helen? She's gonna move down here, she's gonna pull the lever. Okay. okay. I think that's no. all of them. The portcullis lifts up, Jeff. Okay. Oh, I got it. Alright. Alright, let's go. <laughs> all like that? It'll uh, close it on us if we leave. Are you guys just going to leave at this point? Yes. Yeah, mm -hmm. I don't know if I can make it before it. Okay, if you leave, nothing happens. I'm pretty uh, sure the door doesn't close until all four of them are. Pulled. Also, the imp has been dead for two turns. <laughs> Nobody knew. <laughs> it's, 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 no one knows that. Can figure you've been stabbing a dead imp for oh. two turns because it's invisible. You had no way of knowing. Invisible that. again. You know, for several minutes? No, it's a spell. It has to. It is a spell, so it would go for the duration. No, I'm saying, does it ever become visible again? And when the spell duration would end in a couple of minutes, it would become visible. I think it's minutes per caster level. Yep. If I could flip a table right now, I would. No. Um, okay. So <laughs> I can't make it before that door shuts. The door is not going to shut. The only no. reason the levers pull, were pulled is because the imps were pulling them after you. Oh. So they pulled all four of them? That's why they it took them three two, turns to pull two, the They pulled two, two, ran over, and pulled two. Is what they did. Uh -huh. There was more than one? There were, there were two. Yeah. Now okay. two imps. Yep. One of them got dispatched, well, relatively quickly. Mm -hmm. So you, you have defeated the uh, annoying imp battle. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and <sighs> I will need a moment. I'll be right back. Okay. Well... Well, God damn Pathfinder hands. Society. <laughs> Fuck this game. I think we should make a secret plan to do something secretly. Yes. All right. Here's what we're going to do. Step one: Darren's going to attack the enemies yellow. as long as they're visible. We'll tell what? Darren to stop. Jeff. <laughs> Jeff <laughs> entirely just said visible. That's all he said. I've been getting a lot of lag with oh. people's talkings, too. I've only been getting it with you and Jeff. Mm. Speech and well, video. I'm probably... Oh, you're probably getting it for me because my internet is bad, I guess. I thought that it was better, but all of a sudden it's just shit. So, who knows? Yours seems to be fine for me, Ed. Yeah, like, well, I don't maybe, have I don't know, maybe Vegas got them fat pipes. I don't know. <laughs> Jeff is really like skipping a lot though for me lately. Yeah, oh, really? I bet his internet's actually really good. Stop yeah. running that porn. No, I got it. I'm, I'm streaming, but I got everything porn. coming through just fine. Your video oh, lags dead. considerably. Yeah. True. Mm -hmm. And sometimes uh, words don't come out when your mouth. I blame moves. down to Nabby. What is is Lisa watching down to Nabby? Probably. It's a decent plan. Doesn't really use I watched very the much. first. <laughs> I watched two seasons of Downton Abbey. What the fuck? <laughs> oh man, that Dowager Countess is a bitch. Mm -hmm. <sighs> that was a really frustrating fight. I had no idea what was going on. I, um... I actually felt like I had a pretty good idea what was going on, but I had no way to impact it because I was oh. on the wrong side of a of a portcullis. So, <laughs> so, so I was just like. Jeez, I'm gonna hit the levers again. I lifted the portcullis once. I'm not doing it again. That's for sure. Yeah. Yeah, the impact falls apart a little when some of the mechanics get a little detailed in Pathfinder. Good damn it, Jeff. Yes. Why would you use that word? Mm -hmm. What word? Impact. That's a fair you word. You just said impact. impact. Maybe it was. Maybe it was Ed. It wasn't meant to be Over a pun. Impact. I was just he said it. impact, not compact. Impact. Like, we were fighting imps. Compact? Oh, like no. Butt. No, that's pretty good, but it wasn't oh, Jeff, fun. Jeff wasn't going for that. No, it's so, I'm so it. sad that you, had a, that you had an okay one, and we you know, ruined it by not. I was going to say, we knew you didn't mean it, because it was pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> Normally, Jeff's a little bit of a trickster, but not Fair. this time. Fair. All right. <laughs> it was the devil. Somebody had said that he's a little playful. <laughs> I'm back. Jeff's camera skips so much, there's so many, like, derp faces going on, it's pretty <laughs> great. <laughs> the 
Did you ever see the Rory face that we? Yes. That was amazing. Remember, we kept multiplying his face and putting on every one of our damn uh, Pathfinder characters. What is back? What? what? <laughs> I took a screenshot of that. Right by the way. the stairs, I guess. So there's the yeah. Uh... Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna stairs. follow Helen. Sure. Helen's gonna go down the stairs. I'm gonna follow Olaknot. Uh, no, Olaknot's gonna warn you guys about going up the stairs because there's a so. trap at the end. The stairs go down. Yep, sorry, I don't know why I keep saying up. Um, you guys can determine your order. You're I'm arriving. Last again. <laughs> You're arriving on the, yeah, on the far side. The I tried to west buy, side. grab my character, but I grabbed the portcullis. You can delete the portcullis. <laughs> it's not important anymore. Um, I, I would like to go first, and I would like to search for traps. All right. Is there another thing we can look at? Yeah, there should be. Is this a hallway filled somewhere. with blood and corpses? Oh god, it yes. is exactly that. Just maybe. <sighs> okay. Mm. Well, Rory, um, I'd like to roll a perception check for oh, uh, seeing if there's a way to disarm the traps in the sure, room. Sure, you can see about 10 feet ahead of you with a perception check for searching for traps. I'll do that. 27. Oh my god, crushed it. I don't. Um, you do not see a Oops, sorry. That's four percent. I told you the wrong yeah, side. You guys are coming on the other side. My my mistake. There's a difference. Yeah, yeah. probably. There's a lever. At the oh, there's a lever at the far end. Oh, oh there's, there's, there's a lever there. at the far end. Um. Oh, that disables the trap. <laughs> there's a lever at the far end. Holy shit. Um. Well, we do know a sprinter. Um. Is there? Is there a disable device check that I can make on this track? What was your perception check? A 27. Okay. Um, sorry. Sure, you've been rolling them 27 something you fierce tonight. You do not tonight. see a um, trap in the first 15 feet of the hallway. In the square he's in or the two squares in front of him? Yes. I'm sorry, What did you, did you say I don't see a you trap? don't see one. In the first 15 feet, squares, right? there is not a, 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 no, 10 feet in front of you, so the first 15 squares of the hallway, you do not see a trap. You got a 27, so you do see a creature, however. Yeah. Okay. Um, there is a guy <sighs> hiding in this stairway. What a, and he is, you I, are you're not. You're breaking up for me. There's a guy what? Hiding. Hiding? Who you saw, so you are not flat-footed when he attacks you. Is he just standing there? He is crouching I... in the uh, in the stairway with a crossbow, hiding there, ready to shoot, and he is shooting you. No. Okay, no. Just shoot. <laughs> I'm going to. So he 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 is taking a shot, okay. and then we're going to go into initiative. But you are not flat-footed for this shot. Okay, sure. Ooh. It's like thank goodness he's shooting Helen. He misses you. All right. <sighs> Badly. Good. Initiative. I don't like initiative anymore. I do. <laughs> I don't like initiative. <laughs> I remember the last game. Wow, it really doesn't like me. With any luck, I won't Good. even need to act in this in this combat because I'm not going to. DM should fail tonight. <laughs> oh, um, can I have said something that when I get shot at? Uh, no, that was effectively a surprise round. Okay. I mean, this. I'd like to think he said, "Ah, oh, shit." <laughs> that's fine. As, as the crossbow goes over your head, that's fine. Okay. Ah, threw the whole crossbow at you. Shinsaku? He said he's a creature, but I don't see this guy, so I can't there's, really do anything. It's just a. There's a guy in the stairwell. <laughs> His name's do you not see him? <laughs> it seems good. But we can't see him. Well, I mean, you're in the stairway, so no, you can't. Okay. Well, you'd then probably I be able to see him if you were at the bottom now. Because... Um, but no, no one is at the bottom. It looks like there's a five foot gap between you guys. No one went to the bottom of the steps. You left some. Time. Helen's the next one in line. Right. None of us can so, pass Helen. So right now, Oliknot is the only one who can see him. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. So I then I been be him, but because I don't know what's going on. No, I just put myself in that square so that other people could file in behind me. But whatever. I imagine the moment I stepped in that square is when he shot. Yeah, you were like looking around, and he just decided to try to put one between your eyeballs. It doesn't matter to me. Shinsaku, what are you doing? I said I was holding. Sorry, I couldn't hear you over all the other We'll keep talking. talking. So. Helen is going to um, move down the steps 
Okay. So hey, each square um, step is, is not, uh, ten feet because it is squeezing. So that's ten. Feet. Each square is ten feet. So that's the first. The first five foot for you is ten feet, basically. Okay. Because it, you're you're squeezing, so you're at half speed. So that you can keep moving, but that that's ten feet of movement. This would be twenty. Nope, because moving into a person square is not. In, that's fifth. Oh, right. Is no, it's small. Stop. I'm small though. But, if that means anything. So no, no. So you can move through alley squares, and it doesn't cost extra in Pathfinder. Remember. Sure. Uh, obviously, okay. we don't remember because when you move there, a trap. axe trap is going to come down okay. and try to hit you. Um, if you have danger sense, you can apply this to your AC. I have danger sense and uncanny dodge. Uncanny dodge doesn't help against traps. Fuck this. And you're not yet raging. Uh, that would be a 26 to hit you. Oh! That's your blood's going to come right out. That hits you? <laughs> Okay. I'm not even gonna answer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I need to. Uh, I mean, you need to make it? a save though, or something. No, but you will take five points of damage. The axe seems to swing back up into the wall. You are aware that. Um... Sorry. Uh... Those two squares is where it was swung through. I could have probably done that in a better Hey, man, fashion. that's fine. Live life on the edge, I say. So the axe swung through those two squares. Okay. That makes more sense than my first attempt at showing that. Yep, and I'm going to continue on. Yep, you can continue on. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay. Get in this crawl. Okay, you are attacking through the portcullis. No, he's not attacking. I'm not attacking. Okay. There, just so you know, you, there's a portcullis between you and him. I don't care. So he will have cover against your attacks as long as there's a portcullis. <laughs> However, there's also a lever right next to you. Okay. <laughs> Can't touch lever. it. Pull the lever. Move action. Rubble? Chop. Uh, I guess I don't I'm delaying because... I mean, uh, next one. Not really much I can do. Uh, I think Shinsaku is the next one who can go, or who can. Yeah, you can't pass people in the stairway, Jeff. Yeah, we have to wait for Shinsaku. Oh, oh okay. Is Shinsaku going to act at some point? Yes. Oh, Britt, do you want to do Yeah. Here, I'll go down. Okay. Just you need to go further than that if you want people to pass. You have to pass all, if not. Okay. Still just moving. Is that a double move for you, Jeff? Mm-hmm. Okay. Ramo, are you an act or? Yeah, I guess I'll. Uh, I mean, is that as far as? That was a double I'll move. move. I'll move up to Davrin, but that's all I can do. I'll move yeah. up to uh, Ramo, and I'm gonna rub her neck <laughs> to the best of my ability. Okay. Oliknot. Uh, Oliknot is going to. I'm gonna say, is that Jinx? <laughs> Yeah, you knew it was Jenks, huh? Mm -hmm. uh, Olegnat's going to move forward, and knowing that there's a trap there, he uh, wants to try to disable it. Okay, are you aware of how long disable device takes? No, I don't. I don't. Okay. Disable device does not take a single round. Um, okay. So you can start the attempt, and we will determine how long it will take you, but it, for anything that is more than like DC 10, it will take at least a D4 round. Gotcha. Just, I, I, and that's why I'm letting you know. So, like, no, um, I, I don't know. So you have to tell me. What... So that, that's why I'm letting you know right now before you start trying. That's fine. Um, so, so, like, if the DC is 15, it's a D4 round. If it's 20, it's 2D4 round. If it's more complicated than that, it takes even longer. Uh, that's that's fine. It's hard to disable devices in combat. There's actually a rogue trick specifically for yeah, making I it. That's fine. I understand that. Um, I'm still gonna try it. Sure. You'd have to be one square further to actually start the display. I can do that. I can step on. I have the, okay. the movement for that. Okay. So then you're take, you're going to roll it. Uh, roll it. Two d four. Okay. So in three rounds, you make your check. Okay. Jenks is gonna go. You gotta love Paizo names. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, I do love Paizo names for what it's worth. Classic. He's so janky. 
And um, do it. Do it. Do Shoot it. Shoot in melee. Shoot in melee. Well, you have support, Callisto. So. Yeah, his tactics really don't like him being in melee, but he will uh, drop his crossbow and draw a short sword, sure. and try to stab you. All right, Give me a second. My D my AC is fifteen. Yeah, he's stabbing through cover. <laughs> my AC is higher than fifteen. Your AC would be a seventeen. This is light cover. Nice. <laughs> That one's like the <laughs> highest AC I've ever had by a wide margin. Not high enough. Doesn't Sometimes make you get stabbed anyway. Does a 19 hit you? <laughs> Fuck you, yeah. Sometimes you get ganked. Seven damage. Alright. Um, Helen, it's your turn. Helen is going to, uh, in Sorry. a fit of awesomeness, kick open the lever and then attack the guy. Okay, move action to open letter, lever. There's no more portcullis. <laughs> You may yes. now attack him. I am going to power attack him. Whoever designed <laughs> the portcullis in this floor was an idiot. <laughs> yes, they were. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I like that the other room was a was a devious, uh, a devious and annoying invisible creature trap, and this room is a is a is a hallway <laughs> with an axe and a and a poorly designed portcullis. I <laughs> Different am engineers. Actually, um, I'm not going to power attack. Okay. The last room. I'm gonna the, last, <laughs> the last room was the trap engineer, and this room was his apprentice, who might have been drunk. <laughs> and they're like, "Ah, yeah, let it go. Let's just let it do it." Okay, turn to crit. <laughs> oh, <nice. laughs> yes. Jenks is about to get janked. Oh, come on. Okay. Oh. Okay. Um, no, I am going to hit him for? with normal person damage. Normal person damage. It is. Yep. Normal raged person. Are you power attacking but not raging? I am power attacking, and I am... I'm not power attacking, but I am raging. Okay. And I do have a stance that gives me plus two to my damage. So, 16. Okay. Oh, Lord. It's not like that. <laughs> I hope not. Um, mm, great top. swords. Uh, five foot step up. Um, I don't think it's possible to... Wait. Oh, look not. Did you roll a check yet for your disabled device? Uh, no. And you probably could do something... If you have a some kind of spell, you probably could, but I don't know if it'll last until my check. It's up to Rory. Um, guidance lasts a round, I think, or is it a no. minute? The only thing I would probably be able to do is inspire confidence, but all it does is just give a confidence bonus on your skill checks. I, I like that. You want it? Yeah. All right, inspire confidence for you. Yep. Uh, I'm just moving. You're not doing anything else? You're not going to continue walking forward? No. no he said he's just moving. He's, he's working Doesn't on it. very far. Rommel? <laughs> Sweet time. Um, uh, I see a guy. Does he look... Mm. I'm sorry, what? Uh, I'll shoot him with magic missiles. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Meh. Okay, like, what kind of music you like? Oh, not... Six damage to Jenks. Jenks takes it like a man. Tayang? Nice. Is he truly like a Jenks. man? <laughs> truly, truly, uh, truly outrageous. I wonder if me moving Gem? across that trap would, uh, would muck up the work. Or... Well, I mean, I'm not going to tell you what to do. <laughs> uh... <laughs> I am done. Yeah. I'm done. I trust all of that. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna Actually, Actually I didn't even see the trap go off. You're taking your second turn of three? Uh yes. Okay. Jinx is gonna try to hit you with a short sword. Alright. No. Oh, excuse me. All right, now remember, fight. Evo, you're no longer getting that light cover. <laughs> I'm no longer getting that light cover, but he can't do enough enough damage to break my temporary hit points. But he okay. missed anyway. Whoever is next can go. I'm sorry, there's a big spider I'm killing. Yeah! <laughs> oh, come yeah. on, man. That eats the bugs in your house. He's doing I believe the next person is, uh, hanging out. is Helen. Have Sheila throw a plushie at it. 
That won't kill a spider. No. No, what it might do is have the spider latch onto it, and then when the plushie makes its way into your room, the spider will lay its eggs. I'm actually slightly right. concerned about this. About every other, every third night, I've seen the same species of spider crawling along this wall for about a two-week period now. That's not good, probably. That means that they hatch, buddy. An exterminator. So there, there must be an exec somewhere or on my computer desk. Basically. Holy shit, Helen. That will hit. 18 damage. <laughs> you have slain Jinx. He's so I'm going to say... pick up the crossbow. Oh, so janky. <laughs> Okay. We hardly knew you. Jankies. But it's always, if only one at a time. But why one guy? Why one spider? Same, one spider. Oh, oh. Yeah. I was with Lee on I the one guy I thought you were talking about bit. Janks. Uh, you can make your disarm check, Olek Nut. Brit, um, what is the uh, inspire competence? You get a plus two bonus. Sure. Um, if you wanted to move out of the way, somebody could probably give me a guidance or something for this, too, if they wanted Oh, yeah, there's you a destiny. destiny if you want it. Yeah, I'll take that. Sure. Just plus one. No big deal. So that's You'll plus three. Plus one. One. Okay. If there would have been two janks, it would have been so much better. Two janks are better than 20. one? 20 is the, what you needed. Oh. <laughs> Thank goodness for that touch of destiny. Sorry. You <laughs> can arm the swinging axe trap. Oh, good. Um, best. All right. Hey, um, at tier six, seven, there would have also been a swinging scythe trap. Nice. <laughs> I'm gonna. I say, probably uh, still would have rolled six on that too, and that's why we go for high bonuses, guys. I'm gonna say, hey, does that poor sucker have anything on him? I'm gonna gesture towards the, the corpse that Olaknut was standing over. Oh, I mean, I'll search the corpses. Yeah, he's got a couple of potions, a breastplate, heavy crossbow, master of short sword. <laughs> yeah, I'll awesome. um, I'll start lifting things up. I'm gonna say, um, here, pass over the potions. I'll I'll identify them. Sure, I'll throw one. No, I'm kidding. I'll hand it over. Yeah, right. Can I use detect magic to try to identify sure. potions? Sure. When I you don't know. Some of this stuff might be magical. When you detect magic, you determine that the breastplate and the crossbow are also magical? Hot stuff. Sure. I'll say, Rommel, do you want to check out the... Uh, because Jane stuff? is loaded. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll start examining some stuff as well. Sure. I got a 24 on the potions. Two potions of cure moderate wounds. Oh hell yes! I'll try to ID the crossbow. Sure. Should we give at least? Should we give one of these to Helen and one of them yes. to like? ID not... plus one crossbow. Heavy. Uh, that's fine. Uh, anybody want to give me crossbow? A potion of cure moderate wounds. Yes, oh, squish yeah. monster. What I'll was the crossbow? It. It's a plus, plus one, one heavy. heavy crossbow. Can I drink it? I don't. I don't think you want to drink it now, man. <laughs> Can I use a heavy crossbow? Well, I mean. Hot... How hard are you? I can use it too. I just, uh, I seldom make attack rolls. Get him. Give it to him then. What about, no the one... what about the breastplate? Yeah, I'll ID the breastplate too if I can. <laughs> Take it. Wow, I really know what the breastplate is. It's a plus one breastplate. <laughs> plus one breastplate. <laughs> oh, hey, it's on the always you available drink list. Davrin, you should wear yeah. the plus one breastplate. So is the plus no, one he's too the busy drinking the crossbow. Gavron yeah. also has a <laughs> yes. like masterwork play more or something. I have oh, that's true. If nobody else is taking this crossbow, I will carry it for the time being. There's also a masterwork short sword. Uh, oh, Shinsaku could use that. There's ten bolts also, Rommel. Nice. Or Taiyang. Yeah, I guess I'll I'll take yeah. the bolts. Taiyang could also use the short sword. Could you? I have a um. Have I, I have an array of weapons on me already? <laughs> And um, masterwork doesn't really help me that much. Okay, are you guys going to proceed down the next stairway? Yes, Helen let's get this shit over with. Is going to get some healing. Yep. I'd I will like heal to... you when I get there. Okay. And I'll go first unless Helen is trying to go first. Helen is going to say, uh, "Can we have a minute?" So you're yeah, longer for peace. That is a little winded. What? Are you okay? Yeah, you I just feel a little winded. Come, 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 my dear. You can place yourself in the order of your descent I I at the bottom of the stairway. Leading back. I can't do One a man more. voice. I'm too high pitched. Oh god, man! <laughs> come, come, my dear. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> I always assumed Shinsaka was okay, more of I'm a good. more of a ladies' man than a, a gruff, beardy McBeard face. That's very true. I just, I'm just very furry. 
So you guys can uh, so, uh, play uh, ladies first or, uh, or get out of the way. How do you guys want to descend? But uh, put the first person at the, at the steps, and everybody else back. You can go first. And I you've, done, uh, you've done all right by me, Oaknot. I like you going first. Oh, I good see. I'll go third. Okay, but listen, if we're going down these stairs, take it, take it quiet. I want to get the drop on the next one. Take it quiet. If you guys oh, want I'll to look at Davrin and say, you can do it. I'll try to stealth. Oh, I will go yeah, stealth, and if they feel like they can't, they can lag behind. Stealth, you're I funny. <laughs> <laughs> if it, uh, are people lagging 30 feet behind Oaknot? At the top I'm of the 30 feet behind him, I'm pretty sure by virtue of the fact that I'm at the very end of the line. No, I'm not going to try to lag behind. I will try okay. to sneak. That's actually 18. I'm just okay. gonna hang out behind Davrin. So Davrin, sorry, you're my you're my leader here. <laughs> um. So, so Oleg is the first one me, getting I'm the bottom. Who who is stealthing behind him and who is not? Rommel is. Helen is. Helen is right behind him. And stealthing? Right. Yep. Okay. Davrin is right behind him and stealthing. I'll be Stop. right behind Davrin and stealthing. Okay. I'm, I'm dead last and stealthing, but I got a five. And Shinsaku, <laughs> is Shinsaku stealthing also? Uh, yeah, I guess. Give it the old college try. I'm also going to fail. <laughs> We what did that high five? five. No. Zero. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So you guys are not stealthy because you have enough people wearing heavy armor. Well, I'm rolling it anyway. No. Nope. It's obvious. <laughs> I rolled. Did not pass, I'm I sure. rolled a four. Okay. Rory, I'm the first one down the steps. Yes. What may I see? Uh, just one second, and I will. You're going to reveal the sixty feet. Mm. Um, you see a perpetual thick fo a gray fog covers the floor of this ancient stone room to a height of about fit. six inches. Fog? Four alcoves extend from a small circular center. The north and south alcoves are lined with ceremonial slabs on which rest skeletal bodies garbed in old finery. The west alcove contains a spiral staircase that winds down from the room above. And the east alcove contains only a simple wooden door. We can, I can uh, see the wooden door through the fog. It's only about six inches off the floor. Oh, okay. It's, it's sorry, uh, I'm in the wrong layer. Uh, you also will see some creatures in here, sorry. Which, Does I the fog to... look like it's disturbed as we walk into the room? You also see some creatures in here. Oh, sure. Oh no, Jinx! Jinx and Jinx's brother, Danx. Not, not, not Jinx. <laughs> oh. I wish I was capable of wearing medium armor. I should wear medium armor because I'm not casting you any spells. You recognize two Devil Claw mercenaries in this room. That's less good. I'd rather have Jinx. Can we have Jinx back? Oh, you can, can roll Jinx? initiative. Sure. Uh, we will do that. Can I bring back Jinx? Oh, oh that's <laughs> bring back. <laughs> Mm. Here we go, Rebo. Oh, 17, nice. I really think we can maybe retcon Jenks' death, because I think that in the second season, this character's really going to get interesting. <laughs> yeah, I, I think we all agree that you could bring Jenks back. Do you all really want to know what Jenks' backstory is all about? Jenks <laughs> is a failed Hell Knight who is How did he get so there. rich and stupid? Is what I was <laughs> <laughs> rich stupid One of the tenants <laughs> of the... Uh, um, Devil Claw mercenaries. I bet you Jenks got all that really good stuff from all the people that died in the traps. Uh, Britt, did you roll your initiative yet? No, sorry. Yeah, he didn't get it through his own intelligence. I bet there's a, uh, I bet there's an NPC named Spanx who shows up in the next, uh, yeah. in the follow-up. And there's another one named Flanks, and you know what he does. <laughs> <laughs> Flanks, Weirdly, Tanks, and Tanks? Uh, he's a, weird. he's a he's butcher. He's a it's weird. <laughs> Strange that flanks that flanks right. is a barbarian and spanks is the rogue. Normal or s surprise round, Ray? Normal round. All right, five, ten, fifteen, twenty. We're um, still in spiral start. Oh, it's you have to wait for people to move. Oh, I can't uh, you move can't past, move people. past people. Uh, I'm holding. Okay, Hyung. I'm holding. <laughs> oh my god, I go last. Okay. 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> that both five mercenaries are gonna go. Um, it's crossbow time. It's crossbow time. Five seconds. Time. <laughs> um, they're gonna back up and say, "How did you get down here?" We like the party. <laughs> okay, Olek not. Uh, he's going to move, but I need to ask if I can make a perception check while I'm moving, or if that counts as action. Um, you can make a perception check while you move. That's fine. I'm I'm looking to make sure see what's up with the um fog because they didn't charge at us. Sure, you can make a perception check. Oh, that's good. It looks like ordinary fog to you. Okay, I am going to still avoid the fog that is ordinary fog, but I won't know anything about it. Uh, let's see, that's 5, 10, 15. Uh, this would be 25. This would be 30. Sure. Um, that, and none of that took my actions, right? Nope, you did a move action. I would like to um, throw a dagger at one of them. Sure. Diplomacy negated. Diplomacy is over. Ooh, we, really we don't diplomatize with people whose names, whose titles are Devil's Claw mercenaries anyway. And if you're also... Chalaxian, you might. Hey, yo, 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 not... you say. I don't with these guys. You say, how much are they paying you? I'll pay you one gold more, and then you ask them politely to move out of the way because you own them now. And they probably say yes, sir. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I know, I know uh, how Chili X works. range increment is minus two to throw from here? Yes. Okay. Nope. Well, I got some low rolls out of the way. Glad for Daku? that. I'm gonna hold. Rommel? Rommel. I'm going to hold. Oh, Helen? before all these Helen's people... Go. Oh, okay. Sorry. Uh, let's see now what's going on. I'm gonna go after Helen. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna put everyone in their initiative order after Helen. How does that sound? Pretty much it. Actually, I should probably put them in Davern, Rommel, Shinsaku, Taiyang order after Helen. <laughs> I'm so happy I get here. to go last. Okay. You can make a perception check. Okay. Everything seems normal and ordinary to you. Helen Just... is going to go... Uh, a big smoky room. No big deal. A big misty crypt. Nothing to see here. Misty crypt is my favorite porn star. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's in the necrophilia. It's really strange. <sighs> Helen is going to say... Um, did I, do I know that Oak not threw a dagger at them? N n no. Okay, I, Helen is going to say, um, uh, we're here to talk with, I don't remember. <laughs> Ser Serena? As you yeah, charge Serena. forward. Selena. Oh, Selena. No, she's not charging forward. She does have her weapon always out. Okay. But she's not charging forward. Sorry. She's just sure. moving up to him out of the fog. And she's going to say, we need to talk with Serena. Okay, well, Can that will not get a response. And it was Selena. 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 Damn it. That's what you get for listening to me. This is a normal square. Yeah, right? not known. Uh, sure. Uh, I'm going to make a diplomacy check anyway. You can make a perception check, Jeff. I'd love to. 17. Would you? Do you really love to? Uh, you notice some of the skeletons are moving. Rommel. Can I say the skeletons are moving on my turn? Sure. Awesome. <laughs> Oh, I'm not gonna go up. I'm gonna go down by my buddy. <laughs> my buddy. Ah, uh, that's it. Hey, hey little buddy. Hey. Okay. Hey, um, I don't know where initiatives are. The skeletons are going to activate at this point because you say have a nine, and that makes sense for their initiative. Everyone's after three. Everyone's after three. Okay. Well, 
they will go last, then that's fine. Shinsaku? All right, I'm going to move my ass down here finally since everybody's had making their way. You said it's time to go down the uh, their stairwell? It's ten yes. Per space. It's 10 per space. Oh, oh Jesus. Six skeletons? I hate that double set. So then I would just be here. So Whoa. the skeletons um, ignite and start to stand up. Okay. Moved. Passing. <laughs> Taiyang! Uh, Wait, did the skeletons up... go before Taiyang? Are you taking up that whole space or can I. No, it looks like it's underneath Taiyang according to the uh, turn order. Yeah. Um. Britt, did you not move any further? I moved down as far as I could go. That was uh, double move for her. Did you double move? She was 30 feet back, so that would look like a double move. Okay, then double move. Okay. Through. I can't. I'm done. Okay. The burning I'm going to rubberneck to the best of my ability. Um, the burning skeletons will go. Britt, did you start singing or no? Or does that take an no, action? No, I wasn't sure what was happening yet, so Shinsaku wouldn't have started singing. Okay. Holy shit. Yeah. yeah. This thing got messy real fast. Uh, Jeff, you could take an attack from me on that skeleton. I would love to. There. Nine. That will not hit. Done. So one is attacking, um, Davern. Okay. Does a 6 hit you? Nope. Does a 14 hit Helen? No. And none of them hit. Um, <laughs> Oleg knocked. Oleg That's not... what you get for lighting your skeletons on fire. I'm just Oleg saying. Oleg is going to take a 5 foot step. It is not Oleg Knott's turn. Oh, you just said Oleg Knott. I, yes, they attacked all of not. None of them hit. Oh, Olignot. okay. Sorry. There was a long pause after you said none of them hit, and then I thought you were just telling me to go. That's um, what I thought too. Sorry. No. The Devil Claw right. Mercenary as well back up, and then you may go. Uh, Oliknot is going to take a five foot step. Sure. And he's going <laughs> to throw a flask of holy water. Sure. <laughs> yes. He's going to throw it at this one that I just moved off the thing a little bit. Is that. Does that make sense? The middle one, I assume? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Or, I'm mean, sorry, let me ask you this. Am I going inc to inc incur a bunch of penalties for doing that? Because he's no. between two of them? Oh. No. Nope. All right. He's not in melee. He's not over 10 feet away from you. <clears throat> um, okay. I'm going to do that. It's just basically a throw action, which is a, yep. a dexterity based attack. Dexterity based attack bonus. Mm -hmm. Okay. That would be... I think you're aiming for his punch. Yep. 12? That will hit. Okay. And the damage is, I think, 2d6, but I don't know... It's 2d4. That... 2d4? Yep. Um, it's, one one... Splash. it's one it's point of splash. Yep. 2d4. Is there anything... Um... Okay, 2d4 to undead, right? Uh, five damage. Okay, he's doused in holy water and he explodes in a fiery death. Nice. Had you, been, had you been adjacent to him, you would be on fire. Well, I also <laughs> would have gotten hit a bunch of times because I would have been adjacent to them trying to throw something. Um, are you, also, are you does done? Flash damage touch the others. Yep. And what is that? Just Helen? one damage a piece. Yep. Yes. Just one. Helen's Helen? gonna uh, hit the one that she's standing next to with a power attack. <laughs> which, which, which one? The one that is right below her. I'm sorry, um, I forgot one thing. You started your turn adjacent to the skeletons, so you took damage, Richard. Oh, sure. Ah. You will take eight damage. Oh, that's good to know. Helen, you will take ten damage. Is, is there no reflex or anything to that? Nope. It's just an aura. Okay. Just an aura. Ah, oh, damn it. Mm. Oh, I think I might have done something much different if I would have known that, but I guess and it's too late. Helen is going to... You still killed one and injured two. 
Well, what I mean is I probably would have uh, moved instead so that they, I don't know, I guess they would have just moved up to me no matter what. So we're good. Yeah, they're medium. They probably have the same movement you do. They Helen's are not range. slow. I mean, that's a lot of damage. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. It's a d6 per skeleton. Mm hmm. 25 to hit. That'll hit. Hopefully, Helen does not get started on fire, but I expect Helen damage. to be on fire. It explodes. You can make a reflex save. Let's see. Twelve. Twelve is what you needed. You only take three points of fire damage. Oh. Davern? I got a me. And you're probably not on fire anymore. I'm gonna attack him. Or you probably don't start on fire, right? Um, uh, Jeff, we're starting adjacent to one. You mm -hmm. do take three points of fire damage. Oh, uh, okay. I only I'm get a 13 to hit. Step away, Jeff. Okay. That will not hit. Right. I'm sorry, what was that, Evo? I'm also taking a five foot step away. Sure. All right, I'm done. <clears throat> Rommel? Yeah, okay. You uh, take six points of damage? I'm gonna take six. Yeah. Cool. Take a five foot step back and I'm gonna shoot the uh the one up north uh, along the center line of the room. Um that is not adjacent to anybody. This guy. Okay. Yeah. What are you shooting it with? Shooting with a crossbow. Get a plus one heavy crossbow? You could also make knowledge religion checks on them if you have it. <sighs> okay. I don't have it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You say that like I'm trolling you. I was not trying to troll. No, I, it's just like every. It doesn't matter anyway. Hey Ed, thanks for oh. trying to save my life. I will Can I take a move action next turn. I'm in ready. addition to my five foot step to reload my crossbow. You can. Hey, I'm gonna heal uh, Oliknot. Okay. Hey young. You told me what of course, I could make a roll. I knew what naturally. religion check was for, but then I had already basically said I was going to attack. I don't have the skill. Right. You, the religion check is not an action, however. I know, but it's just like you're 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 having me make a check to know okay. that this skeleton is going to resist the damage from my crossbow. That's okay. actually not what I was asking you to do, but that's okay. Okay. I wasn't trying to be cruel. I know. It's just like. Okay, I am going to cast. Grease. Okay. Right there. Sure. This, okay. I need to um, retrain that spell because everybody has it. I don't have a lot of useful spells. That's why I have it. Um, I know. Also, I'm okay with having like 30 uses of Multiple grease. Multiple greases I, I'm totally okay with. Um, I would have greased Jenks if I could have. <laughs> oh, anyway, yeah, I'm going to grease there. I think do they immediately make a save to fall over. One makes it when it fails. If one further north has failed. Sure. Are you done? Uh, yep. That one's gonna take a five foot step. Okay. The other one will stand up and make it acrobatics to move into this square. Oh, uh, well, whatever. Um, I tried. It can't. It can't move though because it had to take two move actions. The other one will take an attack and miss. Okay. They are not great attackers. Does a 19 hit, Helen? You betcha. Okay. And it is 4 damage and 3 fire damage. And does a 13 hit Daver? 13 charges. 13 no. It oh yeah, did, I prov did he provoke nope. one? Nope. Well, he had to have gone south and then... Nope, it's not yeah, a hard corner. It's not? Nope. Okay. Weird. I thought, I thought you provoked for moving inside of someone's threatened area. He didn't move in, inside. He, he did a diagonal into. step. Yeah. Oh, because he's not into. I see. Yep. He's um, got snapped a grid, so it looks like he did an L shape, but he's yeah. really trying to do a diagonal. Um. This guy's going to charge you. Okay. Yeah, that's cool. I can stop him. Sorry, I had to switch to a different page to get that. <laughs> I <laughs> this guy's I gonna charge you. Does it spell Uh, 12 does not hit me. Okay. 
<laughs> the other one is going to continue to stay there. Olek Nut. So glad that he charged. Um, okay, Olek Nut is going to. <sighs> Sorry, Olek Nut, uh, you'll take some fire damage also. Yes, go ahead. Six points of fire damage. Okay, mm -hmm. getting closer. Um, uh, it, there's no such thing as a withdraw type of action, is there? There is. It's called disengage. Disengage. Called withdraw. Oh, is it withdraw? Uh, it's disengaging withdraw. 5e. Yep. Uh, that's considered a action, right? That is your turn. Um, and do I have to roll some kind of CMB nope. for nope. that? Your first five squares of movement do not provoke. Only my first five, but not my next five. Correct. Right. So if you move, yeah. if you move you back move. into Shinsaku Square, you move through me. You won't provoke it from anyone. Gotcha. Um, I'm going to. It does take your whole turn. Yeah, you That's have to continue. Fine. You can't end. I will die if I get assaulted by these skeletons. You can't stay in Shinsaku Square though. No, no. I I just haven't continued to move because I was talking. Yeah. I, I, so five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty. I'm gonna just I'm gonna hang back. Sure. Um, Helen. Okay, sorry. That is a full round action. No, but during that move, am I allowed to draw another weapon? No, because that is a full round action. All right. Damage or? Sorry. Four. Okay. You can draw a weapon as part of a move action. How am I doing so hot? Yeah, I'm no, I, that's why I asked because I didn't know if it counted. So her, the skeleton. I still have a weapon out. I just don't have two weapons out. Okay. okay. 16 to hit. That'll hit. Uh, oh, come on. 11 damage. It explodes. You can make a reflex okay. save. The save doesn't seem to be so bad. Eight. Though. You take one point of damage. <laughs> Cavern? 23 to hit. It explodes. You can hey. make a reflex save. Alright, you also you took six, you took four damage from being adjacent and mm. six damage from exploding. Okay. I'm done. I'm probably gonna move, but I'm doing my hit points. Sure. Rumble? Oh yeah, I'm gonna shoot this the very same skeleton as last turn. Sure. Only this time successfully. Okay. Nineteen? I am also five foot stepping. Is okay. Nineteen. Nineteen will hit. Forget about it. Six damage. It takes a little bit of damage. Shinsaku? Shinsaku is going to take a five foot step this way. Okay. And I'm going to heal Oleknot. Okay. Jesus hey, Christ! Fuck we you, know. man. I'm charging that skeleton with a flail. Two. Okay. Yes. Two. I got it. <laughs> Fucking twos. Taiyang out of nowhere with the flail. Hit it? That'll hit. Uh, six damage. It explodes. All right. Make your flex save. Oh jeez, I think this is. I, don't, I think most of my saves are bad, but I think this one is bad. Small. Thirteen. You take one point of damage. Neat. I will. I'll say something like, like angry, like. It'll take a five foot step and try to hit you with a sword. Sure. And try to hit you with a claw. Does For what it's worth, does a negative two hit you? Oh, it's that is my AC. For what it's worth, Chiang does seem really, really mad, like um, at flaming entities. He's gonna charge Shinsaku. Is he gonna move through my threatened area? What? He will. Can I take an attack? Oh man, okay. I should have stayed there. At twenty-one. That'll hit. Well, damage. Pachui chomp. He does not like that. <laughs> I borrowed Pachui chomp from Sean. He is going to charge and power attack on this. Does a 22 hit Shinsaku? <laughs> God, yes, it does. It's stupid it didn't charge me. My AC is quite pathetic right now. Seven damage? Oh, that's not bad. The other one is going to... Uh, 
Davern, do you want to become an ally for him? No. He wasn't sure how dumb Davern was. It was worth. It was worth. You're gonna, you're gonna miss Alan. <laughs> Holy crap! You can go. Okay. Um. There is a zeroth level spell called Unwitting Ally, which makes someone think you're an ally for purposes of flanking for one turn. That's awesome. Olknot is going to. <laughs> it's pretty move worthless, around, though. And he's going to attack. Uh, he's going to draw his second dagger while he's in movement. Sure. And then he's going to attack with one attack. Okay. Uh, and I assume you're kind of looping around to not provoke. I did. I actually okay. purposely moved my icon in the order that, or the pathway. That's fine. Um, okay, fast turn. Helen? Okay. Uh, Helen is going to attack that great guy in the face. You can attack him. We'll see if it's in the face or not. With a power attack. Um, Bard song? Sure. Nope. Nope. Okay. okay. Been healing. Sorry. Okay. That that makes sense. I'm okay with this. Of course you are. I need. I'm running out of arcane points. I only have two out of four because I never use all my arcane points. Not even. <laughs> Twenty-six to hit. Mm -hmm. phase. Yep, that My looks like rolls are monstrous. Twenty-one damage. Your damage rolls are also monstrous. He is very unhappy. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's a man cleave. Jeff? Yeah. Okay. Is there anything weird about moving into the fog? Did the I whole know? floor is covered. You saw You're one of the guys charge the straight across the middle. The, the fog has been, like, the whole room is covered in six inches of fog. You've been well, I'm going to move whole... there and attack him. Sure. Does a 15 hit? It does not. I'm done. I like this encounter a lot, because it makes you think that uh, that the fog is the danger, when in actuality it's just fucking exploding skeletons. Um, <laughs> I gonna... Speaking of which, uh, can you give me a d6 of damage? When we're in threat range, can we actually still turn? wand heal somebody? Yes. Is that the One's thing? Yeah, yes. you're Richard's still hurting, I know that, so... Rory, you give me my, my d6 of fire? I'm gonna heal, oh, it's uh, not my turn, it's I'll look not again, yes. Can I get skipped? Yes, Rommel got skipped. Rommel, go ahead, you first. Okay, uh... Ooh. Because uh, Jeff hits pass. Back. Oh, it's cool. That's why uh, you, Rommel got skipped. Whoever's yeah, after yeah. Jeff should, should be aware that I will skip you a lot of the time. I am... Um... This is Jeff's fault. <laughs> no. Uh, oh. I'm, I'm passing the turn for I'm me. Sorry, I didn't even notice one of the heck knights is right next to me. Uh, Devil oh, Claw mercenaries. Ah, uh, he's a heck knight. Well, I've been doing that. He's wrong a heck knight at best. Heck knight. He's a a, a mother failed knight. He heck knight. Um, I uh, <laughs> am. Back up. Shoot skeleton. That skeleton, that doesn't seem to work. It's so good. Uh, huh. Alright. I'm gonna give it a try. I'm gonna try to color spray the Hack Knight. Okay. Would you I'm like to include one of somewhere or all of your allies Sorry. in this color spray? I can would include me in it. I'm a beefcake. Okay. Because I can. Uh, for. Um, hold on. I think you could get two of your allies in this color spray if you try. I successfully cast defensively, and I'm not going to get any of my allies in it this time, even though I could. He a gets a 14. I believe it is DC 15 for a level one spell from my that makes spell sense. book. Yep. Um, so. He has three hit dice. Okay, then he is going to be suffering, I think, the same ill fate as the imp. One point of fire damage. Round. Okay, I'm gonna swing at the What's skeleton. That? Line, I'm, uh, while you're while you're determining, yep, while you're determining that I was just moving on. Okay, that's all. Yep. Four rounds of blind stun plus one round of stun. 
Sure. I got a <laughs> seven. Can yeah. hit the skeleton. That will miss. <laughs> okay. The skeleton is going to attack you. Mm-hmm. But it no longer gets oh, to play. Oh, sorry. Him. I was gonna. Oh, it the right, guy's stunned. Oh, Aleknod has a heal coming. I never rolled it. I'm sorry. Because we went back sure. to Rommel. Of course. Sorry. Why don't we even fucking bother? Uh, does, does a 12 hit Tayan? No, it does not. My AC yeah, is the skeleton misses six. twice. That guy is going to... Did you add your flanking? Oh, it would, still wouldn't have been enough. He's also oh, not no, flanking. He was flanking because the guy stunned. God, I'm over here. Does a 19 hit Helen? Yes. 10 damage to Helen? Oh, jeez. Oleknut? Is, um, Taeyang down or something? Nope, I'm fine. No, no, but the the mercenary is stunned. He's stunned. You can free... You can, stunned uh, I'm blind. I can just you, kill him, right? I don't... Can you coup de grace stun? No. Nope. You can't coup, but he's I... Not, he's not helpless, but... But I you do believe you'll get, get your sneak attack no matter what. You will get your blind, sneak man. And he is blind and stunned, so he... Stunned also his, loses dexterity. So his I mean, AC is gonna be pathetic. And so he's got, Yeah. He's he's double sneak attacked, but he's not helpless. Does he does he get a shield bonus if he's stunned? Uh, yes. It does not affect your AC other than no dexterity and minus two. Sure. So I'm Ugh. going to do. I'm going to attack twice. Also, you're flanking with me. Sure. I I yeah I knew that I did that last time. Uh, <sighs> yeah, uh, Twenty six. Dexterity doesn't 20. really help that much, but both of those will hit. Okay. Yes. And I like no this song, right? That's true. She's been there's she's no been keeping you technically no, alive. No, I'm just yeah. making sure there's no song. Bleeding fat gushers. Uh, wow, eight damage. Okay. Oh my god. Yeah, it is possible to roll all ones except for one dice. Would mm -hmm. you roll three on an I've eight? I've been rolling ones on all of my heels. Nice. Helen. Helen is going to power attack this guy with. I don't think I'm I've not power attacking. I've rolled I've rolled a couple ones tonight, but I've rolled a lot of twos. This is just normal. 19 to hit. What? That was damage roll, Damn man. It. Oh, that's damage. <laughs> <laughs> I call shenanigans. You got to roll 2d6 for the attack roll. Well, I know what your damage roll will be if you hit. Uh, 28 to hit. That'll hit? Jeez, you man. 19 you damage, he dies. 19 damage. Okay. God, you just smushed his whole Davern? torso. Alright. So... The skeleton's still up and not stunned, right? Mm hmm. Correct. Five, you can 10, charge it. 15, 20. No, mm -hmm. I'll just attack it. 16 hit. 16 will hit. 11 damage. It explodes. Both of you can make reflex saves. Mm -hmm. I got a 12. Yay. 13. Both of you take 3 damage. Yay. Yay. Fiery. Rummel. <laughs> Um, that was great. Should we just roll, when, out of, outside of combat, should we just roll the d8s from our own sticks if Brit is acquiescing to healing That's us fine. for as much? Yeah, you can just, just keep yeah, I'm just gonna, uh... Oh, that is a very God. common maneuver to do is if Shinsaku's willing to heal and you're willing to take a few minutes. Uh, I have wait. plenty of them. I'll give Oleg not the touch of destiny. Thank you. Shinsaku? Uh, I'll just do one Fardic performance. Oh, this guy's stunned. This guy is stunned. I don't worry about it. Cool, I have more damage, hopefully. I'm gonna yeah, bludgeon him. Damage. That's at least two damage if I hit both times. Mm. <laughs> a quarter more damage than I did last Damn, time. 24. That'll hit. Oh, it was actually 23. I'll be right back. My addition is bad. Oh. I think he's, he's stunned. He is still stunned. <laughs> he's gonna be stunned a long time. 10 damage from a flail. Okay. Hopefully on the in the brain pan. Only stunned for three more turns, Oleg. Nuts. <laughs> hey, Oleg oh Nuts going to go. Yeah, um, this guy's in a bad place. We should push him down. Twenty-four and twelve. The twelve misses. Okay, and then it's one d three. Just push him over. Be like, uh. <laughs> I can't see who's and whoever's damage. pushing me over. He dies. Oh, thank goodness, because I rolled a one again on that d eight. Yep, but he is still dead. Thank you, Shinsaku, <sighs> for the healing. I had taken five damage. Oh, she's gone. I had taken Thanks, five man. damage, and I was at nine life. That was just from burning. I'd like to, um, I'd like to start searching the bodies. Sure. Yeah. 
I'd also I'd like to start searching the crypt. They have uh, masterwork chainmail, heavy steel shield, and masterwork long starts. That sounds really the familiar. Skeletons and make Dever and carry it. The skeletons <laughs> have broken scimitars and uh, broken chain shirts. And they're Don't also I... broken. What about the little gravestone things oh, or the little those are pretty yeah the graves the, the Um. You find a sack filled... The, the mercenaries have a sack near the door filled with antique items. Hmm. Pretty looted. I like it. <laughs> Would you like to make an appraise check on it? I don't have a appraise. Intelligence. I don't roll intelligence. Uh, Unless somebody does have a appraise. I'll I help you then. I, <laughs> I add plus two. Okay. There you go. Most of it is actually junk. It looks like they did a very poor job of looting, but you do find a couple of armlets, bracers, and decorative weapons that would in total be about 50 gold. Okay. Neat. Um, give me a second, and I'll, I'll we'll wait till Brit's back, I guess. Unless you guys have other stuff you're doing in this room. Would you like to search the door? Yeah, sure, I'll do that. I was about to ask if Holok and I could do that. Uh, yeah, he's got to be over by the door to do that. Does he have to be on the square before the door to do that? Yes, you okay. generally need to be within five feet. Searching for traps takes a long time. Sure. Because it's like every five feet that you have to search. So sure. there are just some... some yeah, I learned that when I was playing games. Davin that searching for traps is a slow process. You don't find any traps. Okay. Uh, does the door seem locked? No. Uh, sure. I will, uh... I will open the door. Is everybody oh. going to go where they want to be but when you open the door? I'm going to cast shield first, by the way. Uh, yeah. Sure. Um, sure. Sure. Shinsaku probably wants will, to be close. I will cast a protection from evil on myself from a scroll. Sure. Sim Sim Salabim. I have not taken any chances. Anything in the My room? AC is now 20. Give me a second. Okay. Don't give him a second. He's probably putting enemies in there. Okay, then I'm going to charge a really in. good spell. I'm going to have on a scroll. How long does Major Armor last? Is it hours per level? Uh-huh. Damn. Pretty sure. That's pretty good. Megasus don't get Major Armor, weirdly. Okay. Um, it's because they can eventually wear heavy armor and stuff. Great upright stones dominate this room, evenly spaced out to allow for easy passage between them. The stones have been perfectly carved to form bookshelves, each with six different shelves containing various books, notes, maps, and other crammed in documents. A perpetual thick fog covers the floor of this room to a height of six inches, and most of the documents in the lower shelves of the bookcase appear moldy and rotten because of the condensation from the fog. The room has a pungent, musty aroma from all of this rotting books. You see in this room a obviously Chalaxian noblewoman who is outraged to find you in her home. What does obviously Chalaxian mean? She has pale skin and dark um, hair. Yeah, it's like uh, kind is of she, like European or something. Is she dressed like a crazy? They look. They tend to wear black and red. They like spikes and gemstones. They like gothic looks, and they're very, very pale and black skin, like vampires. Uh, like black hair and pale skin. Sorry. Like, so they look. So Chalaxians, by and large, look like traditional vampires. They look what about like the grotesque thing in front of her? That is a grotesque ball of flesh and mud. Oh, delightful. You can roll now. There's planes on it if you'd like. I would love to. A 12. Hey, honey, the only thing you missed is that there's a nasty flesh thing, and also she's in the back and she looks upset, and it, uh, you the can roll the knowledge planes. The stone things are bookcases. And she's, upset yeah, and she's all emo. It is um, initiative. If that wasn't... Okay, yep, there's I initiative. That. Huh, initiative, huh? Doing okay, Brit? Knowledge planes. I'm not feeling too great at the moment. <laughs> Ow. Knew it. That was the other. Oh man. I need that next level. I actually I was going to write a note to myself to say, Brit's not going to be feeling good by the end of this PFS, and then I didn't. But I was going to use it to say, Ha! I knew no. you weren't going to be feeling good by the end of this. Something's not right, but. Yeah. Your house haunted? I'm sorry. Uh, that is the wrong creature. I will get the right creature there in a second. Um, 
when I switched, this was the only one I forgot to switch. That was my knowledge planes, by the way. It is 20? Was 20? Yes. God. It is a um, dredge. Oh, that's worse. Dredge? Okay. A dredge, yes. Yeah. Dredge. Dredge is her worst. Dredge. <sighs> yeah, she looks um, exactly like a vampire. So weird. She's not. They're just. They just look like vampires. They're actually just assholes. <laughs> <laughs> Total dickweeds. I am playing. There's all the rain that was promised. What? Oh, it's been raining here a lot. I promised no rain. Richard. Uh, I'll send it that way. I'll send it that way. Please. But I dance you only have for to your it this room. way until we move, and then you can keep it. I'm sorry, what? Richard's okay. gonna give me this, rain. This image is not loading. It just is not working. So I'm not gonna I'm worry gonna about use it. Use this thing sure. I'm just gonna use that thing. It looks different than that. It looks more like a green, like green gorilla ape thing. Ah. That's moldy, rather yeah. than a ball of mud and flesh. But that's okay. Um, I'm going to play at 180% zoom also. What? He just said he was playing at 180% zoom. Dude, it's awesome. He implied it's it was the awesome. Big board. It's like you're playing in first person almost. It's like I'm doing a super, <laughs> super sized puzzle. Shinsaku, you are first. Oh, fantastic. Um, I'm outside the door, so I don't know what's happening, so I'm going to hold. <laughs> oh, no. see the the thing because I thought you were. Oh, that's thing. right. I'm the Probably one that holds the knowledge the plane anyway. So yeah, I guess I can see the direction. See. That's fine. Um, product performance. Let's inspire courage. Go. Okay. She gets to go now. Oh shit! It's necromancer time. It's probably just mean wizard time. They didn't say. I think that uh, she'll take a five foot step there and cast Glitter Dust to hit Olignot, um, Helen, Everybody. and Rommel. Meh. You three may make will saves. <laughs> oh, nice, Helen. That's what your non raging will save looks like, huh? Yes. Ah. Oh, no shit. I rolled a 20. <laughs> so if if you uh, get DC 18 or higher, you are not blinded, but you are still uh, outlined with glittery sparkles, and now look like you've been bedazzled. On the blind last. Ah, uh, you make another save at the beginning of each of your turns. I'm uh, sorry, the end of each of your turns. I move up here and attack. Okay. Does a 24 hit? It does. 18. Okay. Wow, you did not need that oil of bless weapon, my friend. Um, Jeff, this is not special at all, right? Normal oh, weapon. Damage. Okay. Okay, who's next? Uh, that thing. The dredge gets to go. Did you okay, tell the... us about the dredge? Oh, sorry. You get to ask um, two questions. Oh, I mean, like, physically, because it, you it looks like, like a green ape thing. It's a like green, moldy ape thing. Uh, the, whoever got the 20 can ask two questions about it for knowledge. What questions do you want to ask, Brit? Strength, oh, I'm asking it questions? Yeah, you yeah. roll When you knowledge. make a knowledge, if you make a good enough knowledge check, you can ask questions like what are its defenses, does it have any special attacks, any special forms of movement or vision or anything like that. I don't know. Sure, special attacks. It has spell-like abilities of cause, fear, and stinking cloud. One more. Mm. Can I tell what its AC is? Sure, its AC is 14. Here you go. <coughs> it will attack. We can do a claw claw bite on Jeff. Sure. Does a nine or a ten hit you? No. 
How about a 21? Mm-hmm. With the bite. The oh, bite. the bite's the one you want to hit, too. For five damage. Okie doke. Actually, it does not matter. Its claws and bites are exactly the same. Weird. Taeyang? Okay. Um, Taeyang is going to go. He's going to go... He's going to use the swift action to make his weapon magical. Sure. He's going to go... Oh shit, I'm going to provoke, aren't I? Yes, probably. Um, acrobatics. Uh, oh god, this is going to be pathetic. I'm not going to try acrobatics. Just hit me with whatever you got. My AC is 20. Provoking. He's going to try to bite you. 20? God damn it. On the dot. Yep. Seven damage. Oh, Jesus. Um, I'm going to hit it with a silver <laughs> mace. Okay. Uh, sorry. Your knowledge check tell, will tell you that this is a demon, not a devil. Well, the mace is the one I have out. Okay, so... just, let, just letting you know. <laughs> it takes me time because I don't have a high enough base attack bonus to do shenanigans. Sure. Um... Uh, Britt, did you uh, bard song? She did. Okay. Um, does a 24 hit it? It does. Seven damage? Bludgeoning damage? It takes a little. Good enough. <coughs> Rommel? Um, I am blind. Correct. Can I reach into the square that I know Olaknot is in and give him the touch of destiny? Is Olaknot willing to assist in this action? Uh, yeah, sure. Okay, it works. All right. Oh, now puts his arm. Out. <laughs> you awesome. can make a will save. Actually, you know what? Can I do something else? It doesn't uh, take any effort on your part. Basically, if you don't want him to touch you, he would have to make an attack roll because he's. <laughs> oh, what I was gonna say is, can I have him touch Helen? <laughs> no, <laughs> I'm trying to touch you, so okay. I think you can take it. Probably away. you can make a will save at the end of your turn to end. Like, All right, no. I can. Yep, every turn at the end of your turn, you can make a will okay. save. Okay. Oh, you should have gave yourself touch of destiny, so you do your will save. Well, worse than ever. Helen? <laughs> Helena's gonna tumble right here. You can roll. Oh, did it make an attack of opportunity? It did already, it yeah. Did. But Helen's but gonna move it has right. two. What? Maybe it has two. Yeah, I'm gonna move right there. Okay. It, rolling. it will glare at you. <laughs> and then I'm going to attack it. Okay. Uh, I'm not gonna rage. I can't believe I'm almost out. This one is ridiculous. Ben, we had we hadn't done bites. a actual dungeon with traps, so I thought it'd be good to throw I like it. A dungeon is, crawl with traps. Is Bard song up? It is. It is. I like okay. the imp room a lot. That trap made me really happy. I like that there were some puzzles in this mod. Yeah. I, well, I liked. I, I just I like the idea that they're that they could just like wait until we were separated by the portcullis and then be like, oh, right. that that is possible. Oh come on, does that hit? Fourteen is it AC? Yes. Nice. Shinsaku uh, can tell you that. Oh. And Shinsaku's like aim for a fourteen. <laughs> oh, and I'm not raging. <laughs> you don't have to. You, you got the crit. You got the crit. So do the damage. I am. That's what I want. And this is an ordinary weapon, correct? This is a nice, normal, great sword. Sure. <laughs> Brody's like, well, I'll subtract five and add 25. Okay. Oh, boy. Okay. <coughs> Six. Okay. Holy you geez. wouldn't have outright killed it had it been at full. <laughs> I did a lot of damage from race raging. Okay. Are you and you're okay. done? Olegnaut. Yeah, she's done. Uh, yeah, Olegnaut's gonna say, um, you're surrounded, you can either come peacefully or you can die alone. You can make a diplomacy <laughs> check. Okay. Can you make an intimidate check instead? Uh, I, you can make an intimidate check instead if you prefer. Uh, they're no, the same. They are the same. She's like the barbarian and the rogue, uh, are not blinded. Bad. And I don't think Davrin is either. 
Um, I'm going to uh, move into the... Oh, actually, I could have got a 19 on that from the Touch of Destiny, couldn't I? Mm -hmm. Is that for skill checks, too? Yeah, you can see him. Okay, it's a 19, then. Okay. Nice. Um, I'm not going to attack her, but I am going to move in the room. <laughs> and we're going to surround her, so maybe it'll uh, stick. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Do I get to take a double move if I like? Sure. Okay. 1, 2, <laughs> 3, 4, 5, 6. There you go. I'm ending my turn. I think you're, you're muted. muted. Yep, lingering is still active. Is Thank you. Said. Sorry about that. This would be the first turn that lingering is active, actually. That's correct. So I'm just going to move to here for now. Okay. Is that all? Yep. Selena will hotly say that you have not proven yourself worthy of her attention in any form and she's gonna cast a spell at you forgot that out. sounds like attention it sounds like she's uh, giving her attention to all of us actually <laughs> at least at least you for sure yeah that's fine yeah. she can do that um that's all right she's a crazy person she doesn't have to make sense sorry not a lot of sense anymore, a little bit Oh, man. I hope she tries to fireball you. Yeah, that's fine. Because that would be the real... No, but she is going to suggest that Oleknot go and get her a fine drink. Okay. You can make it well safe. I am going to do that. There you go. No. You, you feel absolutely 100% compelled to go and get her a fine drink. Well, it's funny because I happen to have a flask of refreshing water on me. <laughs> uh, are these hard corners here in, by the bookshelves? Yeah, they're all hard uh, corners. I, I assumed they were uh, when I made my movement. Does Olik not actually consider water a fine drink? He doesn't drink alcohol and type, type stuff? I don't have any alcohol, but I do have water, so if she yes, wants to but, drink... Yes, but that is not... She's, the, he's wondering what you consider. Oh, does does oh, sure. not actually consider water a fine drink or does uh, drink alcohol? No, I guess not drink. if you're talking about wine and stuff. Yeah. Then what would Oleg not think of as a fine drink if a woman asked him to do that? Uh, Holy I water. want to cast a spell. I'm sure. casting a uh, true strike on myself. Okay. And I am moving to there. Okay. And I'm done. Rommel? I am going to use the Touch of Destiny on myself. <laughs> I'm touching myself. It's my destiny. To be blind. And then I'm going to make another saving throw. Yikes. This is a disgrace. Helen? Helen is going to 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. <laughs> and then Helen's like, shit. And then she's going to move here, and then can I um, make a diplomacy check? Yes. Okay. Um, it is a it is a double move. If That's it's fine. not a double move, then That's I fine. no speaking is a, f a free action. Generally, making a check for social stuff is an actual action, but speaking is not, which is stupid because speaking should be a check. So I don't usually care about it like, too much. I'm gonna say. Um, best give this. <laughs> best give this up now. Oh god! No, Come that's on fine. Now. That's fine. Okay. Oh, your I'll diplomacy let... is pretty good. Man. My diplomacy is awesome. If not, does he get to do a save before he does anything? No, he is compelled for a long time to and get I, her a fine. And this is a room full of books, right? This is. Okay. We do know gonna... that there is some booze in the in the room upstairs. Uh, yeah, I'll just start heading back. How many? Okay. Is, I, do I do a, a double move for that? Yes. Okay. Five. This is what the imps were trying to get us to do, and would have been a lot more dangerous had they succeeded at. Yeah. I don't know if they, but they might have been. You think yeah, that's as far as I can go. Uh, you guys will just see Olek not uh, walking his way back to the door, kind of uh, looking around to see something. I imagine he's muttering like, "All right, two parts, two parts <laughs> orange juice, one part vodka." 
the the perfect vampire. <laughs> Saku. I can't think of one. She is going Russian Saku. Sorry. That's fine. Um. Hmm. Okay. I don't know if this will be a possible thing. Oh God! I just froze up. You guys still hear me? Yep. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Good. Well, I'm gonna head up this way. Was that five, ten, fifty, twenty? Can I attempt to charm her? You can't see her from there. What are the walls? What are they like? High walls or something? So if you move upwards, you'd be able to big, see her probably. Big bookshelves. Hmm. Well, that's thirty feet, so I can't move any further than that. But lingering's still active, just in case. Are you going to take an action? You could move farther with your action. Yeah, you can try do it next to her, or else you can like pin her or something. Maybe. Yeah, you can move like like straight across and then down if you wanted to not be in the line of fire. Or probably like another glitter dust or something. Did she do a glitter? I'm confused. No, just she just if you want to move another time, you can move another time. And then you'd be ready to do it next turn. Or you could stay yeah, here and nice. then next turn move and cast if you wanted. Either no, way, it's really stay. fun. Okay. This um, way is safer. She will try to cast defensively. <laughs> that will just make it. Any lesson she would have failed that. I am yeah. a level 4 character. Her cast defensively is better than mine. What the shit? Oh, hey. Is that a darkness spell? Please tell me it's not a darkness spell. Wait, no, I did that wrong. Sorry. I was going to say, does she have to see the origin point? Yep, yeah, I'm just spacing it. I can't move it quite right. There. Okay. She casts a fleet storm. So now the uh -oh. entire area is full of freezing sleet. Um, it blocks all sight within the re area, and the entire area is covered with slippery ice. No. She is then going to provoke an attack of opportunity as she moves away. What do you mean it blocks all sight? Like you, how, cannot, how... you cannot see if you are in that. You are blind. Yes. It, blo it blocks pretty... all sight. So That's she's right. probably blind too. So she is also blind. Can I? It even stop blind. Can't uh, hit her, right. She's moving blind. away from you. Can and you take attacks of opportunity while you're blind? Yes, because you know she's moving away from you at this point. Because you were aware of what she was starting to do. What's <laughs> the, the not... minus to that? Um, a technic creature you don't know is there. I think only gives you the fifty percent mischance. Yeah, you can attack okay. and get fifty percent mischance. They're like right in front of each other. Yeah, not anymore. They aren't. Did she have to make well, a check were. to move? She did. That's why I just rolled oh. that 24. I see. Ah, oh, 14. Okay. Um. That will miss. Oh, I can. Uh, two is good. Yeah, I missed anyway. Okay. Oops. Davern? Um, can I move slowly not to slip or something? You can make an acrobatics check to attempt to not fall down. Oh, God. So that would be moving at half speed with an acrobatics check. Okay. If you fail, you can't move at all. Well, um, If you fail by more than five, you do fall prone. Uh, two. So you fall prone. Okay. That is your move action. Okay. There's no way to move any slower than that. There is not. Oh, shit. So in order to move, I have to stand up. Right. Well, standing up does not is not moving. You can stand up. I will stand up. I you know. can crawl. You oh. can crawl five feet as a move action. All right. I'm going to make an acrobatics check. Sure. Oh, here we go. An 11? That is enough. All right. Uh, so you move at half speed. Yep. I'm going to move here. Make a perception check. 
13. Okay. I'm gonna... Sorry. Um, I thought you were gonna... Uh, Wait for it. But you're clearly not done yet. Uh, Jesus. Uh... Well, I'm not gonna waste a true strike. He, uh... <laughs> Taeyong is gonna say, Sorry, Davrin. I'm gonna hit the square in front of me. Okay. You can roll an attack roll. Okay. Uh, at 35? Wow. Yeah. Um, you are fairly just... confident that you would have hit something had it been in that square. Rommel? Okay. I think True Strike still adds uh, 20, right? It does. Yeah, <laughs> good. I believe it also ignores the humans. Um, we. I, uh... if, if you, uh, I'm pretty sure it ignores concealment also. Sure. that I have had the presence of mind to cast protection from evil. Is she evil, for the, for the record? She is. It would not have made a difference uh, in the success of my previous saves. I am going to try to use the touch of destiny on myself again and try to make another save. Is it your destiny to be blind forever? It is. Nice, you rolled low again. Helen? She's... Helen is going to... Um... I also noticed that I rolled low. Thank you for <laughs> helping me. Um, Helen is going to try to I'm move in the with acrobatics. Sure. What, what did I help you with? Uh, observing that I had rolled low again. She's going to try to move five late. feet forward. Yep. You can make a perception check. 17. She is diagonally in front of you. Okay. I considered attacking that square. Can I continue moving forward? Yep. Well, you had one or two, right? So Yeah, it was a 50 I'm going to say... You can surrender or we can do this the Just hard way. Just kill her, damn it! I'm going to uh, keep hitting her. <laughs> you begin to hit her. She hasn't been struck yet. I know. I'm going to keep attacking her. And you're also uh, going to keep tongue lashing her. Oh, right. Please. That will miss. Oh, Damn butts. It. Oh, nerd butt. Nerd butt? Olic nerd butt? Olic nut. <laughs> uh, that, like, has dick to butt? To move, right? Yep. Is he? Does he need to make any kind of save from the spot he's standing? Nope, he's just out of it. Okay. Uh... <laughs> I'd like to. I like to imagine Olaf not still just listing off. Maybe, a, maybe a Bloody Mary. That seems appropriate. Oh, I made it to the stairs, but not in the stairway. Sure. Going up the stairs is difficult terrain for you. Steep stairway. Uh, sure. So I have to go at my normal speed, basically. Yeah. Shinsaku. So you can get like um... one level per. Bardic performance would have to go back up at this point because okay. Linger's already been three rounds, so back up. Do you want to move at all? Uh, yeah, if you allow me to do an acrobatics check. Of course. Well, she is actually pretty well tracked. Except when I roll ones. Like, all night. <laughs> okay. She's going to go. Um, Helen can take an attack of opportunity because she's casting a spell. Uh, uh... Does she risk casting it defensively? Well, she does it pretty easily, so I don't see why she wouldn't. Her, her defensive casting is good. It, it's at least a plus 15. Um, she's not going to cast defensively. She'll provoke. And nope, she will. No, she, she, will. Also... she will. She will. She will. Well, that's a she 17. Will. She will begin to cast a spell. The spell is going to go longer than her turn. Uh, can I hear her? You can make a perception check to try to hear her on your turn. So, does the does she cast defensively? She did, like, yes. Okay. So I can that was crawl, a 19. I can crawl five feet as a move action. That's a real rule? Yep. Or not? So can I yep. drop to the ground as a free action crawl and then stand up? Yep. Get a five foot step done. You can make a perception check. <laughs> Right, I don't really need this. You're not actually where she's in the square next to you. I rolled Isn't a one, she but currently chanting? I do know or... there's only two squares. Oh yeah, sorry. That would make it the DC is low enough now that you can be aware that she is there. I would. Uh, I do know that she is not in the square that is directly in front of me, and I'm going to try the other one. Okay. So I'm going to roll my mischance first. A one is bad for me. All right. I whiff. Rumble. Try the same thing as before. Yay! And I'm no longer blind, is that the case? That is correct. 
damn it. Will be when you get Alan? in that storm. No one's gonna attack her in the face. It's not okay. a sandstorm, though. No, it's a uh, sleet storm. So, no, do 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 And Bard Song is reinitialized. Yes, yeah. it is active. And you are probably considered flanking at this point. I don't All think right. you can flank with something you can't see, but I'm you not sure. You can flank attack. because the other person is threatening her. Okay. No, okay. it has more to do with threatening her than not power attack. attack. I mean, I'm going to rage. Okay. I believe you. I'm going to rage attack. Ah. Yep. Run. 20 to hit her. Is Helen good? No, um, yes, she is. You miss. Alright. Olicknut? Olicknut is going to mm -hmm. get onto the stairway and he's probably going to appear at the next stairway. Just let me check one, one thing quick. I might have been wrong on that. <laughs> Ed, you've got it up right now, I think. Protected from evil, is it plus one or plus two? Plus two. two. Okay, then yes, you do miss. Two to AC and two to saves. Okay. I, I wanted to make sure that I wasn't being crazy. That's cool. I mean, it's not cool, cool, but it's like... Shinsaku? Anyway. Slinger like, performance right. is up. I'm going to attempt to move. Oh, I forgot flanking. Then I roll a two. No surprise. I think it only takes a ten. I did forget flanking. Did you get a 22, actually? Are you are you sure? Double check all of your things. Three from strength, four from base, weapon focus, rage, Eight. guard. I don't know what rage gives you. Two. Okay. And flanking. So, okay. And you have no penalties, so sure. That would hit. I was just figuring since we were doing it back and forth. Okay, 16 damage. Okay. Wow. You might interrupt her spell. She fails to maintain her spell. Damn. Oh. She has a really good concentration. I said he she rolls. Fails. Yeah, she yeah I know, but he has massive damage. If it had been me hitting her, she probably would have made it. I'm yep, she loses her summon monster 3. Oh huh? god. Yeah, okay, so her tactics just... Stupid tactics. Her tactics are, if they get close, cast summon monster. <laughs> yeah. Why well, don't we do a flanking position and summon for a full round? She is going to cast defensively. She succeeds. Um, she's going to cast a color spray to hit Davarin and Taeyang. Oh, I don't like that. Now, okay, never mind. She knows people are in that direction. I know, but you if... I think that you're going to say that the technicality doesn't apply, but if you can't see, you can't be affected by color spray. That is correct. She does something <laughs> stupid. Davrin? <laughs> that is, an, that is a, such a weird rule that I had never thought about. All right. that is so pretty... I have a mischance, right? One is bad yeah. for me. Um, does a 29 hit? Yes, even if does you're good. Does a you 21 are. hit? It's like a Medusa attacking you with a uh, spell. Are you good? No. That hits. So that's <laughs> a crit if no. she can be critted for 33? 33? Sorry, Helen, how much did you do? He's got a katana or basically a katana. Right, gonna, oh God, you did 16? I did 16. That's 39 43? damage. Okay. Um, e she bust. starts yelling that she wants to surrender. <laughs> Um, <laughs> take her down. Alright, here we go. I got a 22. You're not gonna accept her surrender? Oh, guys. What? <sighs> Nothing. Oh, uh, it Please. is non-lethal, so I would get actually get significantly worse. Are you, are you uh, going to accept her surrender? Yes, I was, I was okay. going to try to hit her and not, she, uh, not she, bludgeon her to death. She, she will actually surrender. She will dismiss the sleet storm, um, and you can go out of combat. You almost killed her, Jeff. She had three <laughs> points left at oh. that point. If he would have dropped her, she would have oh. bled for a while. Horseshoes and hand grenades. Uh, Olic Nut will come back in like a minute or two with a fine drink for her. Uh, yeah, did I get it from the food storage? No, it was actually on the first floor where the wine was. Oh, right, right. 
where they There's... were playing cards. Mm. And you did know there was wine up there, so you probably could have gotten there pretty quickly. <laughs> I, I actually didn't remember hearing that, but I thought I thought you wanted me to go to the food storage. So yeah, the guys the guys were playing cards or playing like dice and drinking wine. And, on the top floor. and gambling for oil of blessed weapon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because they want to make sure you have some way of dealing with devils and oh, just in case. I never drank that oil. Yep. Good thing, too. So she will surrender um, and turn over the documents to you. Is there anything else to find in the bookshelves? Um, nope. <laughs> Moldy books. Other shitty books covered in uh, looking at Looking at the other documents, you see they are, in fact, particu not particularly rare or valuable, and many of them are moldy. You think that all of them together would equal a couple of gold pieces if you wanted to cart them out. That's what yeah. it actually says. <laughs> yes. <laughs> wow, that's kind of dumb. Wow. <laughs> that's mean. Yep. Yeah. It's like there's one thing that's valuable down here. Can we call that Daverin's day job check? I'm just messing with you. What well, is Daverin's day job? He does um, all the books out of his <laughs> uh, If you report what happened to the society, they will hire some clerics of De uh, Desna to uh, reconsecrate the burial grounds of the Declan family and reinter the flaming skeletons properly so they're no longer flaming skeletons. <laughs> um, right. She, Selena, is allowed to leave and head back to Chelyax in disgrace. Uh, oh man, when killed. you go back to Chelyax in disgrace, I'm pretty sure you get just get murdered. It's you pretty get stoned bad. to death. So, um, Wait, she doesn't. Uh, she doesn't get found for murder on the. She technically did not murder him, which will come out that Jenks is the one who actually killed the Pathfinder. Technically, not ordered, Jenks, but. But Jenks is the one who killed the Pathfinder. Yeah, we all kind of knew it was him, though. So, Get Jenks. So you guys yes. do succeed at the Infernal Vault. Yay! Um, I wanted to do a dungeon crawl PFS uh -huh. because we haven't really done one, and we hadn't seen traps like actual. You know, this is a pretty good models. dungeon. I like so, it. So this is one I've also played as what myself. So I went through this as a player first. So I knew this one was a pretty fun, easy, short yeah, scenario in many ways. Fun. Um, at least from my perspective. Still, I know I really there's like a the couple of annoying things. The, the last fight can go a couple of different ways depending on what's there and how you guys deal with it. Um, she has some really annoying spells, but a lot of them hamper her as much as it hampers you. So she has ways to blind people and then things like when they get close, summon monsters and color spray. She should have opened with glitter mm -hmm. dust, summon monster. No, if she knew we were coming, she should have opened with Summon Monster before the door was opening. Uh, she did. Oh, um, that's why that thing was only had one. Her, her curtain that she didn't. Uh, the they don't usually like so people summoning more than one monster at a time because it is kind of cheesy, and they don't usually use that tactic in PFS scenarios. The old school Baldur's Gate style of uh, taking care of things. <laughs> they don't normally use that. So yes, she had more Summon Monsters. The uh, uh, one that she'd already summoned. That the, the draft was already a seventh monster. Um, gotcha. She was going to summon a second one at that point. She had targeted spells such as Acid Arrow and Scorching Ray, which she can't do when people when she's blind, <laughs> um, uh, and Ray of Enfeeblement. And then she had Color Spray, and yeah, so she she was not a well specked out wizard for the scenario she was in which is kind of good in some ways it's like she doesn't have the perfect spells for this situation she just yeah. has what she would have to wear that day um her tactics jenks. Yeah, her tactics are weird but they're kind of fun she was another person who would have been immune to a magic missile because she had shield up um she had the entire time like the second round like as soon as you start fighting the other room she has high enough perception that she hears you fighting. So she starts buffing and preparing. And so she has time to cast mage armor and get ready with shield and protection from evil. Sorry, protection from good. And stuff like that. Okay. So um, I will have to double check how who gets what for out of tier. People who are th third or fourth level, it will be 1,634 gold. Um, nice. people who are out of tier 
the sure one two would have been five hundred and thirteen. Minimum. So, so we are talking about a more than three times difference between the tier one two and tier three four. That's why I said significantly wow. better um, for what's the, the prestige for this. It will. It will be two. Okay. You succeeded at both missions. Um, what was the other one? That would have went so fast otherwise. What? Yeah, this this is a fairly easy scenario at low tier. Um, at high tier, it gets considerably harder because she has black tentacles. So as soon as you start doing bitter oh, dust, she has black tentacles on the group as they open the door. 1,600 how much? Um, sorry, I can only do one thing at a time. I'm checking up the secondary success condition. Oh. I, I said you passed it without checking because you did everything right, and I should technically check that first before I say that. That's true. Yeah, there wasn't much that we couldn't do except for not kill Jenks, but... And you you weren't and he's supposed evil. To, yeah, you weren't supposed to be things like I, it is good to keep her alive. And Shinsako could read the documents. Hmm. Yeah, I mean I can do a linguistics check if you guys want someone else to read the documents. Oh, yeah. If you secure the the documents and have some means of defeating Selena, either taking her in or um, killing her, you succeed. The secondary succession is completing the primary success condition. Mm. Oh, because she oh. has the documents. Right. Oh, so, yeah. I guess, yeah. Damn. Unless there was some way that we could have stole them and fled. Which right, if you had stolen them and she got away, then it, you would have failed and gotten no prestige, I guess. Sorry. Wow. Or here's a question that doesn't have yeah. anything to do with anything. Would this be considered recovering blackmail or incriminating ev incriminating evidence against a named NPC, aristocrat, noble, ambassador, or similar figure? No, because this is the defense plans to the city. Strange how many defense plans to the city of Absalom go missing or get mislaid. We, sh we should do some things with incriminating evidence. <laughs> So, um, Ramo, Shinsaku, and Helen, I know for sure, are getting 1634. Um, I think Davran and Oliknot will qualify for that as well. Taeyang would be the only one, I think, who might be out of tier for that and get the average between that and 530. But I will double check that and get the, sheet, get the sheets correct. It is it. the difference between a couple things or just one thing. So, that would yeah. be cool to know. Yep. I mean, if. If it is the average, it is still a good chunk of money. Yeah. Money is good. Um, this is the first time you've done a higher level thing. And this one actually has a pretty good payout for what you get. So it would be 1,073 if you, 0. 0.5 if you. Yeah. Um, just so you know, there is actually an item that she didn't end up using because. Uh, Oh, thanks. Just, just to help, in case you need that point five. Um, there is an item she's not using that is unique. Something you can't normally buy. You normally can only buy items at lo at minimum caster level. She had a wand of magic missile at fifth level. Hmm. Oh, that's so cool. This is What's a the cost of that. Three thousand seven hundred and fifty. <sighs> so it's pretty steep for an expendable item. Um, yeah. it is limit. It's one of those limit one items. You won't be able to buy a second one if you do buy it because it is a unique thing because you can't normally buy it. But yeah. just letting you know in case anybody is interested. Otherwise, it's a you could buy a normal wand of magic missile, oil of blast weapon, cloak of resistance plus one, potion of cure moderate wounds, or ring of protection plus one. So a couple of things a little bit earlier than you could normally get, but not anything too expensive. Same. Rory, I would like to um, uh, forego my downtime uh, to do a uh, Liberty's Edge espionage type of thing. Okay. Roll um, it. It's, it says that I can do a stealth check, and the DC is equal to 15 plus my character level, which is 17. Okay. And I picked that because my stealth <laughs> is 15. Sure. So anything but a 1 and you succeed. Basically, yeah, yeah, you succeed. Yeah. Okay, so you can mark that off. I am doing that. Okay. Does anybody else have day job or mission things they want to tell me about? Yeah, I'll do my day job. Sure. Um, 
When it says forego downtime, what does that? It means it if means you have you a, a day job, downtime. Time. You, you can choose if to you, do that instead. And if you if don't I have a day don't, job, you can just do it. You can, yeah, you can just forego it then. Try and make one time between each session. Yep. Oh. God damn. Nice, Brit. It's the only time I roll that high. Okay, I will mark that down. Um, and I think that's 50 gold. I'll do it later. Because otherwise, I'm guessing I forgo it. You do it now. try, and if I fail, I yeah. don't do you, it. You do have to roll it now. Yeah. Well, I'm just, I just want to do my completion so I get my two goals. Because now I have two goals. What, what, what are you doing? What? What are you completing? I am possessed number of ranks and one of the following skills. You're, You're just going to do that? Goal. Okay. So you'll, you'll do the other one next time. Because I want two goals. So. Does anybody else have anything that they're completing for their faction? No, I already did the one where I roll a check and I didn't complete anything for factions otherwise. I should have tried to get grappled. <laughs> hey, if you'd done it at 6 7 level, she would have done black tentacles. Oh, hey, if I would have gotten out of it, I would have gotten that thing. I yeah. probably would have gotten out, though. Yes, yeah. I greased so, myself. At, at, the six, at the 6 7 level, she would have done a black tentacles instead of a glitter dust as you open the door. Gross. And gotten the entire party grappled there. And then she would have done just raise, basically, as you were sitting there grappled. Hey, wait, did Rommel Montaba, or whatever his name it is, he, <laughs> did he get. Um, did he get grappled in the entangle where he had to? I'm sorry, or physically bound by the entangle huh? in the last session? I think I did, but I think I also did something else. Oh, okay. You maybe we, did. I think I checked off uh, adventure and and or ran for that one, right. even though uh, that that one doesn't come into play quite so readily. But I well, wasn't really awesome. thinking about well, it. Well, the oh, the sequel to that one will be an Andron also, and I do plan on running that soon. Well, I hopefully get grappled in that one. Well, because I already I mean, adventured in Andoran, so I don't get another check mark for it. Is, are you sure that's how it could be? What? Oh no! Once you do one town, you can't do that second same town again. I thought you said. Is that what it says? I don't remember. It says like adventure in oh, it however says, many in two you know, of the following two of the following locations. So you oh, have to do okay. two different ones. Oh, then Some Gabriel, of them are Teliax, Okano, Magnamar, or Nirmath. Yeah, I was no really ones. excited that I thought we were going to Cheliax and I thought I was going to get that second check mark too. Ed. <laughs> I'm going to go to bed now. But thanks okay. for running. Thanks for playing. Yeah, man. Hopefully it was cool. Thank you. Level three, right? Jeff, did you have a question? Is that what you were talking no, about? No, I was actually going to uh, mention uh, kind of a, a sign-off for our group here. Um, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, next Monday, you're starting the Halloween thing, right, Ray? Yep, next Monday I'll start a module, and I'll do a two-week module, um, kind of a horror module, so it'll be a two-part session um, where hopefully everybody lives. Oh, God. Awesome. So basically, uh, we play two sessions and try to get through a whole module, which is worth approximately the same as like three of these uh, yep. uh, episodes. So, uh, are tune we doing in. fifth edition this weekend? Um, we will see. I'll have to see what plans are like. Um, but for sure, mm -hmm. uh, tune in next Monday. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. And uh, we will catch you soon. Thanks for watching. Yep. Bye. Later. Bye. Bye.